laughing. <laughs> okay, we're live. Not today. Hi, everybody. Not sure who all is here. I guess I can yes. pull, her, pull her up on here. Okay. So we'll see who all is in here. Since I can't. It's easier to type with my phone. Sierra, hi, Rose, Sierra. Oops, I better turn this down. Okay. All right, we're just going to be working on our. Hi, our Davida. Hi, Davida. Hello, everyone. Hi, Davida. We're going to work on our lady today. Mm -hmm. I'm petting mine. <laughs> You're petting yours? Yeah. <laughs> yep, this, this is what wore on me. So this is uh, my dress form. This is from Rosie Posey's kit, her dress form kit. And um, everything on here is from Rosie's kit except for this little applique and some and some other few touches. But um, first of all, I started um, painting my top on with some acrylic paint. And then Kateri and I were talking the other day and thought, do a crackle, but I never did that. So if you guys <clears throat> paint yours and then do a crackle, I think that would be really cool. And then um, after I, I just painted it down to about right here, and then I it came with some satin fabric and some um, sheer fabric with some flower appliques on there. And so the one I got had this really pretty avocado green and cream and white, just beautiful, and then some lace. So I all I did was just kind of hot glued it around the waist and kind of gathered it in the back, and it's a little sloppy back here, but I'm going to end up putting a big poofy thing back here. And um, so that's where I'm at right now. So that's what I'll be working on. That's where I'm at for my uh, my doll, my woman. My woman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. And Rose, what are you up to today? This the creator of this I'm awesome me. kit. Well, I am up to also a dress form. <laughs> I yeah. thought Angela was going to be here, but unfortunately she's not able to. And so I didn't want to start mine until she was here. Mm -hmm. But um, Hi, Deb. I suppose I will start on mine, and I'm not really fully ready with it, but I'll do what I can do. We know what I can do. Right. I'll work on what, what I can do. What I can work on. <laughs> yeah. We want to keep Angela. Yeah. We, yeah. 8.30. <laughs> or, well, 9 o'clock now. Yeah, um, it's 9.15. <laughs> yeah. We want to keep Hi, Angela and her mom in prayer, you guys. She's um, with her mom right now. And um, so she, that's why she's not able to be with us. And Gail is supposed to be here at some point. And um, Kim Stevenson uh, is running errands. And when she gets done, she's going to come in, hopefully. Yeah. So. Um, be a lot of ladies or just the three of us? <laughs> that's right. <laughs> that's yeah. too. I forgot. Gail had to take her daughters to the bank, so that may be where they're at. Oh. So, but she should hopefully be here before too long. Yeah, I think it's 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock her time, I think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I'm just, um, oh, I'll flip over to me. Okay. I'm trying to get better at this flipping stuff, but um, oh, yeah, I'm just you melting. The That's the same fabric I've got. Same one, with the green. Yeah, yeah, and I love it. I think it's really pretty. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm, yeah, I'm melting the bottom of this satin uh, so it doesn't fringe anymore because it fringes really bad. <laughs> you know, it was like it was really distressed when I opened it. Like, oh no. Yeah. But you don't definitely, I mean, I'm glad this is up as high or that candle is down as low as it is because you just need to melt this. Yeah. And the, be very the bottom. You don't want to turn it color. Yeah. Black. You, 
And it will start on fire. I almost did that last night too yesterday. <laughs> yeah. um, you have, you I have had to be big, careful. I had a big string and I thought, oh, I'll just burn it. And it kind of had a little flame going to it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we have to have to watch what we're doing when we do this. That's for sure. Keep a cup of water with you or a spray bottle or something. Yeah, well, I've got both. <laughs> there, yeah, I need to. I'll just throw my coffee on it if I have to. <laughs> oh, well, you then your coffee diet. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. That'll be <laughs> antique for sure. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that, I guess. Nice to see everybody here this morning. <clears throat> yeah, I know it's kind of early for some of you, but instead of watching television in the morning, you can watch us. <laughs> right? This is like, oh, you know what this is like? Did you? I loved when they had craft shows on TV, and they don't have, if they even have any, I don't know. But um, did you guys ever watch Crafters Coast to Coast? Yeah. No, we don't get that. It was, it's an old craft show, but that's what yeah. this reminds me of, is as a new age Crafters Coast to Coast, because we're all over right now. Oh, yeah, that's for sure. You know? Yeah. Hey, Sierra, I emailed you a link. Go check and see if you got it. Deb says she loves the dress forms. Oh, thank you. Yeah, they're really cool when they get done. They start out to be nothing. And then you make them beautiful. <clears throat> Why are see it's weird. <coughs> Hurry up and melt this. I didn't have my glue gun on, and it's like better heat up quicker than it is. Oh, there we go. Glue gun's on. Glue gun's on. <coughs> glue gun's on. Ouch. And the top. <laughs> I don't know why this isn't melting. Maybe it just doesn't want to melt anymore. Go figure. I had to like keep it on the brim and yeah. on its side and then like pull it in a little bit. I know. And I had a kind of a tough time as well. It, it took me longer than I wanted to spend on it. Well, I figure, yeah. And I figure it's a little hard for me because that candle is so far down in that's, there. That's what I was having problems with. It's better if you had but, like a a utility candle or something on a plate. I usually have those tea lights that I yes, use. Yeah, I thought they're better. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. But you, you have to be so careful when you use those that you're not, you know, melting it. That's the thing. I had a, let's see, what did I have? A candle going, but it was on a plate and it was like one of those, you know, those dollar store utility candles, just the white ones. Yes. And I totally forgot that I had it over here because it's, it's you know, it doesn't have any scent or anything. And I threw a piece of fabric over it. And I'm like, oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> I don't know why wow. my tablet just keeps turning on and off. I Your think what, it's uh, my tablet. Oh. Because I can't see my chat on the computer right now. Uh, really? So I have my tablet on um. for that. And it just, I think because there's no activity, like I'm not really doing anything on it's it, but it's never black. done that before. It just keeps turning off. Um, so weird. Right now is um, sing not singeing, but kind of melting the edges so it doesn't fray. So she's just um, lightly melting the edge of her satin so it doesn't fray. Yes, because it frays super bad. It, yes. You will have like shredded wheat if you don't do it. It, it won't stop. You'll have strings hanging down and nothing going across. <laughs> and once you pull it, it'll it'll keep going and it doesn't stop. No. Nope. For sure. Okay. Hi Maddie. Exactly the way I'm. Good morning, Maddie. Hi, Maddie. Yeah. Kateri, Hi, April. I said April, but April has not said anything to me. 
Okay, I'll, I'll yeah. try again, Sierra. Yeah. She's on it, Sierra. I'm on it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm on it. Excuse me, guys. I have a little of a cough. I'll try to. I'll try to put a muffler on my mouth if I can. A what? A muffler. <laughs> muffler. I'm going, yeah. I'm going to switch over to you right now while I'm doing this. Okay. No, that's not what I wanted. Sorry, my camera can't go any further. So, um, so right now I'm just putting on the a satin belt. Um, so I'm just doing that really quick. <clears throat> okay, I'll just do it again. Let's see. Thank you. Okay, so I'll try it again. <clears throat> yeah, so I'm just, I'm using hot glue, um, fabric tack and I don't get along as of now, so hot glue. And then I kind of, you know, sometimes I, what I do when I use hot glue, I don't like bumps, you know, so I'll just smooth it out as it's still hot. So it, you know, so I have a flat finish. I don't know if anybody else like it's bugged. Yeah, I, feel, I feel the same. Do you? Yeah, I don't like big lumpy glue if I have to use glue. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Get all Betty Crocker out here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure everybody has one of these, right? The Betty Crocker spatula. <laughs> yeah. Mine's white. Hi, Abril. Yours is white? Mm -hmm. The white Betty Crocker one? Really? I bought mine at um, during the holiday season. Uh huh. Christmas season, they had them, you know, half off. Yeah. So, see, mine has the snowflake, see? Oh, I love that one. I like the color. That one's yeah. adorable. This one was. Um, okay, Sierra. Dollar Tree. It came. <clears throat> All righty. See what I'm going to do. So I played off the colors off of the skirt that I got my kid in. I just went off this avocado green. I just thought it was such a pretty green. Well, <clears throat> you thought right. I did. And I couldn't believe I had the color in my ribbon box yeah i wonder if i have any of it yeah it's, the ribbon like, I've got. it's by this um celebrated basics basic i don't know is that michael's yes okay. michael's that's from michael okay so it's like this color it's like an avocado it's like a very earthy kind of green <clears throat> Oh, thank you, Abriel. Is, is it Abriel or a, how do you say that? Yeah, was, Abril. 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 Well, that ain't going to work. Abril. <laughs> sorry, honey. I'm Come on, Angie. You're going to learn Spanish now. No, that isn't going to work for me. <laughs> I can tell yes, you that. I just tried it secretly, silently, and I'm like, nope, that isn't going to work. <laughs> <laughs> in English, I say abril. Abril, yes. That's oh it's only because it's abril in Spanish, but I don't know. I guess a lot of people say April, you know. That's what, do you, what do you like, abril? I like, I like April. It's easier for me, but I hear people say it both ways, so I'm kind of, I'm, I get, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever, April. whatever April wants us to call her, Abril, April, April. One day she says, "What? Call me whatever." <laughs> she knows we're we're addressing her. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, honey. 
I'll you know, if, if she has, if she has set it up in Facebook, they have an area where you can well, go in and have it pronounce your name and, and your friends can go in and click on it and they'll learn it. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, mm -hmm. I've got it on mine. I don't know a lot. <laughs> right, Angie? <laughs> yes, you do. You you know lots of stuff. I don't. Okay, so what I did, like I said, I just kind of glued my satin on and then I went over with my sheer fabric and then I gathered it and stitched it right here. And then the piece of lace that I got, I kind of made a, a train, a little bit of a bustle or start of a bustle, I guess, back here. Oh, in. <clears throat> I left the in out. And then um, this came with the kit. This is kind of looks like a veil. And I'm just going to use it in the back of her skirt. Just to, I'm going to proof the heck yeah. out of mine. Yeah, that, that, that was the intention. <laughs> was it? Oh, yes. good. And I, I thought, right? <laughs> yes. Yay, I'm doing it right. Yes. Thank goodness. Yes. <laughs> Rosie's like, thank you for not doing something no. weird with that. No. <laughs> we never do anything weird. Oh gosh, well, I don't know. We don't know. <laughs> You're not sure about that. Mm -mm. So I'm just gonna try to get it even on each side and then glue mine down here. Mm. Let's see. Thank you, Sierra. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm just gluing this down. All right. You should get it now. I left the in out. The in? Yeah. I'm usually a very tattered mixed media kind of person and you think that's what this would have started, but something's happening to me. <laughs> it's like turning, yeah. it's turning when, into ele elegant. What happened is that you're liking it. Yeah. It, it must that's be why you're keeping it that way. <laughs> no? No, yeah, it must I mean I must have a little bit of a uh, Fancy, fancy, fancy. You're reminiscing. Yeah. I I'm kind of sure think I'm sure your wedding wasn't tattered, <laughs> right? No, it wasn't. It was very like Martha Stewart at the time because we got married very in tradition. Yes. It, my colors were um, butter and lavender. Uh, you mean on your dress wow. or, or the, your, the group? Uh, the group in my wedding colors. Yeah, my my group was. Believe it or not, I love purple. So yeah, my my colors were um, lavender and purple. Oh wow! Yeah, see, mine was just very um, very. Uh, we had our wedding in July, so it was very summery, soft colors, and and then um, I had a bunch of butterflies above the dance floor. Um, I mean, there were like hundreds of butterflies, these little tiny, and I, you know what, I could use them now in this shabby oh, stuff, but anyways, there were these beautiful little lace butterflies that were kind of armatures, uh -huh. um, because one of my favorite songs is Butterfly Kisses, so that's the one that I, you know, dance with my dad to, mm -hmm. so I wanted butterflies for that. Oh, that's so sweet. Yeah, so... Hi, Maggie. Oh, good morning, Maggie. Well, it's afternoon where you're at, but it's morning here. Deb is making homemade soup. Yum. Yeah, really. I got my pork loin on. Ooh. Pork? Should be. Of course, Katiri does. <laughs> what? Got your dinner going already. You're yeah. so, you're so, um, like organized. And organ yeah. <laughs> nah, I try to be, but not always. 
I used to be really super good at it. Me too. I'm really bad nowadays. Yeah. So now I'm putting on this this second piece, which it was a longer piece than the. Uh, let's see how did this work? Okay, it was a longer piece, and I folded it in half to make it double. So I left it shorter up here and longer down here. Because I wanted mine, I want mine to be really, really full in the back. So this is going to be my second piece. That's how I like my, my dress forms too. Yeah, I like a big back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a big poof. <laughs> so all I did was fold it in half and um, to where it had like a layer effect. You see how it's coming down here? And then I just ran a running stitch through it. It's a needle and thread. That's all that I'm doing next. What okay. kind of soup are you making, Deb? Is it chicken noodle? Oh, it sounds good. <laughs> chicken noodle is uh, soup. good to have when people are sick. That's true. Homemade. Mm -hmm. With homemade noodles? Yes. Uh -huh. Well, you can. Not everybody will do that. But. I do that all the time. Yeah. Very, them very easy to make. People think that it because it's homemade, it's gonna be hard, but it's not. I, I made fideo last night, Rose. Huh? I made fideo last night. Oh, that's cool. See, you make it. You can put some of the chicken soup that you make yeah. also. <laughs> that's, that's true. Yeah, Jeff ended up eating the whole thing. I'm like, are you kidding me? You have sneaking seconds and thirds. <laughs> I was brought up on, on that. Oh my gosh, she's making veggie, potato, and chicken, and noodle, egg noodles. Mm. Oh my gosh. And then she's like, my kids come and get it and freeze it. <laughs> Yum. That's right. Yeah. I'm going to come and get some. You know what? making it? Deb. We got this away. <laughs> I think I'm going to. So what is everyone what is everyone saying on the chat cuz I don't have a chat. Oh, I'm reading it. Um They were talking about the soup and then uh thank you so much Maddie. She's she's like, "Oh my, that is so pretty. I can't I can't I can't sew either. It's called hot glue, girl." <laughs> 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 yeah. I try, but I call my type of uh sewing whimsical. So I get away with it, right? It's all crooked. <laughs> Hi Judy, how are you, hun? Hi Judy, how are you? Hi Judy. Hi Maggie. I hope you're feeling better today. Yeah. Yeah. Hi Julia. We'll see who else I missed. Hi Julia. Deb. Hi Deb. Guess who came in here? Oh, Lorelle. Hi Amy. Oh, good, oh, Sarah. Hi, Amy. Oh, how you doing, girl? I miss you. Yeah, I'm what have you been up to, Sierra? Oh, Sierra's there now. Oh, hey, Sierra. Yeah. She just came in. Um, okay. I'm, trying to mm -hmm. I'm, a, I'm trying, trying to be a faux, a faux seamstress. So here's what the back looks like. Sorry, this girl is just she's a big girl. And then and then here's what the front is starting to look like. See how it's poofed out to this. I made mine to where it came around her sides. So it's like that. Looks cool. Thank you, Sierra. And then I get to add the fun stuff now. I thought that was fun. <laughs> So what have you been up to, Steer? I didn't hear you. Oh, not well, much. I'm you, Maddie. I started crocheting these um, 
teapots with bigger crochet thread. I was thinking they'd be super cute as like appliques. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, they would be neat. They would be good for that. Let's see. So, anyways, I'm just poofing the dress. How's uh, everything going, Sarah? I'm I'm good. How are you guys? And congratulations to both Katri and Rose. Oh, yes. That's exciting. Oh. Why, 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 why congratulations? Because you're both on the design team for KS for You. Oh, uh, Maddie, did they announce Maddie. it already? Maggie, uh, yeah, she did. Maggie, she put uh, a video up. Oh. Yes. So now you can, you can let people I know. I didn't even know. <laughs> Hi, um, Paula. Hi, hey, thank Paula. you. Sierra was the first one that said anything to me. That was sweet. Okay. A second. <laughs> yeah, you were. <laughs> Congrats, honey. Yeah, I'm Congrats sure it'll be. It'll, it'll be, be fun. fun. All right, I'm going to switch over to Rose. I don't know what she's up to, but. Well, I'm doing a uh, run, what do you call it? A running stitch? Running stitch. It's the one that you do over, like over the. Over the top. Yes. Yeah, that's I really the same. really can't see a lot because my dress form is like really tall. But, okay, so this is, I'm using this fabric, the lace fabric also. Oh, yeah. Um, so I don't think I need the platform anymore because I I already know how long it's going to be. So. Oh, pretty. This is what it is for right now. What I did, I did an underskirt from a tool. It's a, a soft tool. And it's very long. See, this is <clears throat> the end of the, of the, of the uh, dress form. Uh -huh. I made it long because I'm gonna stand it on a, on a, uh, what is it called? A yes. So I'm I'm making the this overskirt and I'll be putting another layer because this is not long enough. So I'll put it on another yeah. la layer under. So that's yeah, what that's I'm. Yeah. What I'm doing there's it's, there's not a lot to it right now yet. <laughs> Yeah, I'm building mine up too. Yeah, so, so that's I'm what doing I'm a. This, is, this takes time, you know, to do the running stitch because it's a very long piece of fabric. Yeah, if you have a long needle, though, you can get yeah, most of them long, on there. It is a long needle. See? Yeah. Oh yeah, same one I'm using. Yeah, yeah I have those big oh, yeah. But I'm yeah. kind of slow when it comes to this. Yeah. <clears throat> Amy's trying to put the toddler to sleep. <laughs> Hi, Laurel. Cute. Oh, Laurel. Hello. Yep, I said hello. She said her batteries on her phone is. She's in the kitchen. Are you making Otherwise, lunch? She wouldn't. She wouldn't be on here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The little kids should lift their spirits up today. And it's Friday. Yeah, wow. that's Friday. the best thing. She loves her Fridays. Laurel oh, says yeah. hi to everyone. I think we all love Hello, Friday. Hello, sis. Even when you don't work or you're retired, it's always a good day. Friday is. <laughs> yes, <laughs> it is. It's different from the Monday through Thursday. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you take on a, a little different routine. Yeah, that you do. Yeah, I get, I get um, two days without having to get up <laughs> early. No one's mm -hmm. getting up early. Let's see. So, 
what do you do professionally, Kateri? What do you, what's your job? Um, I stay home and clean the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a profession for sure. I'm sorry. I thought you, have, you, I thought you, I thought you still w were working, Kateri. No, I that was. Is. I was a um, dog behaviorist and oh. um, dog trainer. I actually owned a school. Oh and wow! So people would come and they train their dogs and. So I retired from that and then I did the dog behaviorist thing where I'd go to everybody's home, you know, when they were having behavioral problems. Yeah. And um, a lot of times the dogs have problems because of the owners. It's not the dogs. So you were kind <laughs> but, of like, um, like the, the dog whisperer. <laughs> yeah, that's what everybody told me. Yep, you're our dog whisperer. I was like, oh, I'm okay. <laughs> but, I just looked at my dog, so you better chill. Okay. I'm gonna send it. I just, all I whispered to the dogs is not to listen to their humans. <laughs> <laughs> it's all, it's like raising a child. You know, if you tell a child not to do something and you tell them over and over again and you actually don't act on it, then they're just going to yeah. sit and look at you like you're nuts. Mm -hmm. But what do you think? way to do the is the discipline thing like a spray bottle or a clicker or what do you uh, it depends you know what they've done um if you don't what are they going to the bathroom inside the house well then i always tell everybody that's your fault because you didn't watch the dog <laughs> <laughs> or you didn't really? pick up on their, on their signal because like on old dogs like you have and i have um sometimes mm -hmm. people don't people don't realize that their bladders don't hold the way they used to and yeah um, like my dog my 15 year old is actually deaf now and for some reason he does not ring the bell to go out my dogs are all trained to ring a bell oh and, yeah it's yes, awesome. my dog um sully rings a bell too and he's my first dog and i never thought it was going to work but i did what the direction said you just paw their hand on the bell and then yeah. one morning i heard him ringing the bell I'm like no way but now he's learned if we don't get there fast enough he's slamming the bell like words like oh yeah oh yeah <laughs> oh, <laughs> do that. It's like get over here My little dog, he just like prances back and forth like just like back and forth and lets his nails hit the floor and just prances back right. and forth back and forth you know, he just makes noise. Like even if it's in the middle of the night, he'll just prance back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And then if he wants food, he'll stick. He'll just grab his food bowl with his mouth and then just drop it on the ground, pick it up, drop it on the ground. Because <laughs> we oh don't feed at certain times. We he just we just feed him when he's hungry. He's never been the type where he wants it at certain times. I don't know. Yeah. He was when he was younger, but now that he's older, like the food will just sit there and go bad. So we just feed him when he's hungry. Um, my vet had always told me that he wished that people wouldn't free will feed their dogs. Oh, really? But, yeah, because he said, you know, when they bring their dogs in and we ask them, you know, have they eaten? They can't answer that because they don't know if the dog's eating out of that bowl or not. And oh, yeah. um, so my dogs actually eat in the evening because um, it was just easier for me. But that way, and if a dog isn't hungry, <laughs> um, you can pick the food up and not put it down until evening time and see if they'll eat then if they don't then you just you keep picking it up and eventually the dog will start eating they're not going to starve um they will eat but um it's just better i've had to take my dogs and even the foster dogs i've had to take them and they'll ask me you know have they eaten today because you know they may have to do surgery on them or um they want to know um how much they ate uh, you know, there's just different th reasons why a vet needs to know that, but um, they um, they just have 
you know, they have problems giving dogs anesthesia and then they throw up because people fed the dog or the dog <laughs> ate, you know, and they weren't supposed to. Yeah. yeah. But well, that's me. I mean, that's just the way I've always done my dogs. And they they eat everything when I put it down. It all gets eaten. So um, I'm seriously now that they're older thinking about feeding them um, twice a day. Just give them half of what they eat. So but um, anyway, I enjoy the dogs. I've got a golden, I think, that's puppy that's going to be coming over here for training. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I'll train that one. I'm only doing it because I know, I know who they are. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. I remember you were talking about how you used to train dogs and do all the championship stuff and go through all the um, dog shows. Yeah, that is just really ridiculously expensive, and they don't. You don't really win money. You just win. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, who's got, who has four, almost $40 to spend on a dog show, you know, on the obedience shows that I was in. And, and then, and, and some of the, some of the classes that I was in, you have, you know, you, if you're trying to get like a UDX or whatever, you have to show in two shows and then you pay for travel and then you pay for your hotel and you pay for gas. Yeah, Laurel says that. No. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. Says, I've got my dog trained to bite me every time I ask him if he wants a hug. <laughs> I know it's so funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can you show yeah. me how to do that, Laurel? Can I? I want my dog to be like your Joe. <laughs> no, you don't. I know. You I don't want your dog to be like that. <laughs> I know. I know. Oh. Your dogs, your breed is not, I have never known of an aggressive Frenchie. No, he's not. If my kids are fighting and he doesn't think it's right, he'll, he won't bite or anything. He just kind of pushes them to, you know, he's just letting them know that he's not okay with he's it. Not yeah. yeah. He he's not understanding that. He's letting them know that he doesn't understand the situation. He doesn't care for it. Right. Yeah. They are protective in a way, you know, I mean, they just have that instinct with their owners. Yeah. My dog is so close with my daughter. And he, when he was younger, he would always sleep in bed with her. And whenever he would wake up in the morning for school, um, so close you know how kids don't like to wake up? Yeah. He would, he would always sleep in bed with her. And whenever he would wake up in the morning for school, Okay. I think it's fixed now. Okay, but but yeah, I'm sorry. What I was saying is like whenever you go to wake up from school, wake up for school, she wouldn't want to wake up, so you'd have to kind of shake her a little bit and be like, "Oh, like, get up, get up," because especially because we had to use to take her to daycare in the morning, so it'd be early, it'd be even, it'd be at like five a.m. because she'd go to daycare before school every morning. Yeah, and if you wake her up. If you would shake her or wake her up or even like disturb her at all when she was sleeping, he would start like barking at you and lunging at you. He would never actually bite you, but he'd be like, leave her alone. We're sleeping. Leave us alone. We're sleeping. <laughs> yeah. My Frenchie is like a lazy teenager. He does not <laughs> in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of them are. Even my dogs sleep later in the yeah. morning than I do. Yeah, I know. I showed you pictures like if his feet stuck underneath the cover. No, I could pull him out by his feet. And he would no. He would not have it. He barks at me to go to bed at a certain time as well. Uh, it is at Abril. Mm -hmm. Mine is different. What's that? It is not as interesting. She's kind of flat and does not have much curves. <laughs> <Not a flat. laughs> 
She's like one of those. She's, she's gonna, like one of those surfboard on girls, but on the both sides. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So funny. <laughs> I have to laugh that she has her dog trained to bite. No, I just <laughs> Yeah. Isn't that funny? Every time she... if I ask him if he wants to be hugged. <laughs> I know. Oh my gosh. I just think that's no, funny. I don't like hugs. <laughs> oh okay, woman. It's funny though. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> It is. It be on the um, animals' funniest videos. Oh yeah. <laughs> the yeah, only thing is, is, you know, it always makes me super nervous. I'm like, man, you're gonna get like torn up, girl friend here. <laughs> you're just yeah. gonna get torn yeah. to pieces. Dogs. I don't know why, but ever since I worked at a um, shelter. Uh, yeah, at a it was like a boarding, like a high end boarding facility where oh, it costs yeah. like fifty something. And this was like seven years ago. It cost fifty something a night for your dogs to stay in the um, boarding facility. Like they yeah. had like little toddler size beds and TVs and little chairs. <laughs> and yeah, like a hotel for dogs, like a high class hotel for dogs. And it's probably I bet you. It, now it's probably like around eighty dollars a night. I bet you, because it was like wow. fifty back in uh, like seven years ago, or even like eight, nine, ten, ten years ago. But um, yeah, I used to be like super cool and any dog and everything. But me animals go in there that are unpredictable, and I've learned how unpredictable dogs can be. <laughs> so, oh yeah. Yeah, it almost makes it sketchy to pet them and stuff. That's kind of the only dog I completely, the the only I completely yeah. trust is my own. <laughs> yeah, I um I got bit by a different picture when I was a kid. That you give them for sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah I was skittish of dogs for a long time after I got bit by one. And yeah. I wasn't doing anything. He just came up and bit me. He was just kind of an aggressive dog anyways and yeah. did what he wanted to do. And well, what happened was, you know, dogs are completely different when you're grooming them. They do just like normally. And I would go help out in the groomer area sometimes. And, man, you just <laughs> don't even see it coming. You're just really? brushing your hair and then get bit. <laughs> really, a lot of A lot of groomers get bit. Yeah. I mean, look at I mean, uh, on the Heine, mine was like, the the arm, arm. Yeah. I got bit in the back of the arm and it's in the shape like a cross, so I felt like it was a good thing. <laughs> That's good. Oh my <laughs> <God. Cross. laughs> it was horrible. I had it I was like, let's see, how old was I? I maybe ten and I was washing my bike and this Doberman who ran the block, you know, we were all scared of him, but you don't want to act scared, you know. So yeah. he came out of his yard and I was staying there I was by myself and I just like, okay, just ignore them. Don't look at him and just, you know, do your thing. And, um, yeah. you know, we had the neighborhood had tried to get this dog, you know, please put your dog away. Don't let him out. He's aggressive. But anyways, he just came up and bit me and I was like, oh my gosh. He didn't like you. He didn't he like your giggles. Know. He didn't like he my you tasted like your giggle. Yeah. Good intro. <laughs> it must have been my giggle. He's like, this girl needs to go down right now and she needs Jesus. We're going to mark her. Her right <laughs> ears are very sensitive. Yeah. You're I, mean, I, I can see it now, uh, April. Don't you call yourself you're a Mexi fry or something? Yeah. Something. Oh my gosh. And then so we, I had to go to the hospital and I had to get stitches. And I remember them giving me shots and I was just crying. I was just so, cause I was more like, what the heck just happened than anything. And, um, yeah, it was. And so I was, I've been skittish of dogs ever since, but then I, I've mm -hmm. learned to just be more comfortable and ask the owner first, you know, and, uh, <laughs> yeah, it was, 
crazy. Yeah. Amy says she got it, bit um, by Amy. <laughs> um, Amy, Rose, hi. Asking, she says, Rose, you can't see the chat, but but Avril, she responded, it's a different dress form than the one that um that we're doing. Gals are working on on the the kit. It's a it's a flatter form, a flatter rear, and a flatter chest. Yeah, it's just a different one. It's one that I've had for 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 a few years. Amy says she was more upset that her jeans got ripped. Let me guess, were they guest jeans? <laughs> Or lucky, lucky. What was the time? Lucky guess or bum? What? Bum jeans. Remember the Never brown bum? Never, Never heard of them. Really? No. They're probably her guest jeans. <laughs> Angie. Yes, honey. I got bitten also. You did uh, too? Yeah. Uh, three years ago. Oh my gosh. Yeah. A German Shepherd. Ooh, that's a good bite there. A full grown German Shepherd. Ooh. He bit me on my foot. Yeah, I only got it? I had I had nine stitches. Wow. Yeah. Were you running were you running from him? No, no. It, it's oh. actually it, it was the uh, family dog. Oh okay. But I, I stepped on him. You know how they <gasps> they get excited and they don't they get know excited they're and they're like all over you and was he an old dog no he was an old oh. yeah okay but he was having issues oh um but uh i was walking around with food we were having a, we were gonna have a barbecue that day and he's you know right there hovering over me and whatever i didn't yeah. see him and i stepped on him on, on his paw his foot. <clears throat> And so he wow. reacted. Yeah, yeah, they do. That's unfortunate. Oh, wow. And that was oh, that was that's one of the things I feared the most: getting bitten from by a dog. Me too. Bye, sweet Laurel. Have a good day, honey. Oh, bye, Laurel. Bye. See you later, bye, Laurel. See you later today, later tonight. And um, Julia yeah. said she got a little. A chunk took out of her upper lip from a puppy with sharp teeth. Owie. Aww. You want to know, you guys will never guess the one animal that's bit me and actually drawn blood. I've never gotten bit by a dog and it's drawn blood. But it, there's one animal that has drawn blood and bit me. A mouse. What? An alligator? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we have tons of alligators up here in Washington. <laughs> Oh, God. A slug. No. Um, a bird? It, yeah, <laughs> it, yeah, it was a bird, exactly. Yeah, so my, when I was in high school with my husband, his sister and her boyfriend or whatever used to have a bird. And I was like so afraid of this bird this because this bird would just walk around and chase you and because they yeah. used to walk around and everything and i was just so scared of it because i seen it you know it it was it bit everybody and so i was sitting on the couch just minding my own business and i creeped up the back of the couch it was on the back of the couch walking right behind me and it seriously just bit me on the neck and drew oh, blood oh, and I I'd have been I'd have been up off of that couch. I know how they are. Oh yeah. I seriously screamed and it wouldn't let go. I grabbed the bird <laughs> around the body and I just like yanked it off. That's probably the worst thing I could do because it took the whole chunk out of my neck. But oh my it God. scared the shit out of me. Uh Rose, can you see the chat? What's happening? Yeah, I see what Amy is saying. Okay. okay. Um Amy. <laughs> The, the girls, like Sierra or Laurel, they're the ones that announce the kit every month. And you can also um, message me if you like when you're interested in one. If you see what the kit is and then you're interested, you can just go ahead and PM me if you like, if you're interested in it. They do go pretty fast. Right now, I do still have uh, a couple of the kits left for the for this next month. It's the uh, uh, Tussie Mussie. 
Yeah. Ooh, Amy like that. Yeah, it's a Tussie Mussy kit and it's thirty dollars including shipping within the oh, US. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Thank you, my dear. <laughs> I forgot to say the price at all. Oh, you're and it's going to have all the laces and trimmings and all the pretty stuff to go on it. <clears throat> yeah, they're fun. I own a couple of Rosie's kits, and they're, they've been a lot of yeah. fun. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like them. Hey, me. Hey, me you know, I love dogs. I truly love dogs, but I am afraid of them too. Yeah, especially like if, especially yeah, now that I know what it really feels like. Them. Right. Well, and that's kind of like where I just asked the the owner now. But I would still be skittish if I was like, you know, walking down the street and a dog came out. You know, I would probably get a little skittish. Oh yeah, I yeah. get very skittish yeah. when dogs come out the, uh, when they're off leash and you're walking in the neighborhood. I actually, because I go on walks every single day and mm -hmm. I walk about two two to four miles a day, and I take a golf club with me, like to walk with me, not to like intentionally hurt a dog if it comes after me, but if a dog comes after me, I, I'm gonna use that club to push it away from me. Best thing to use on them is um, pepper, pepper spray. Oh. Yeah, I have pepper spray too, because we have bears around here as well. So I have bear spray and then I also have the golf club. Amy, have you ran into any wild animals yet on your walks? <laughs> Just <what Yeah>. you <laughs> That is really scary. Yeah, I know. Remember Paula? She said she opened the front door and saw a bobcat across the road. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what? We get we, we get coyotes. Yeah, that we go, get yeah. They come from the hills into the suburbs. <laughs> yes, yeah. we get um, wild turkeys, squirrels, deer, antelope, moose. Wow. Sometimes. Yeah, we get the whole thing over on the eastern part of Montana, which is weird. Uh, that we get, we have bobcats up in the hills too, but they, I've never seen yeah, one but they're there. Aren't moose something to be afraid of too? Can't they like yeah, yeah. moose are really uh, they're dangerous. dangerous. Amy says no, but now I'm scared. LOL, I will carry all I carry is a fly swat. <laughs> 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 She just she just wants to give it like a gentle tap. She's like, shoo. Yeah. She's like, <laughs> no, you don't shoo fly, shoo. Are you gonna have me pick up that fly swatter too so it has ribbons and stuff dangling off of it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, so I bet she has like a shabby chic fly swatter too. And some lace. <laughs> <laughs> got lace hanging off of it. Well, like one of those uh, ribbon oh dancing looking things. My swatter now, right? Yes. Moose are cute. Yeah. And they're very, like, temperamental, especially when they're calving or stuff like that. You don't want to stop them and be too close to the to moose. Yeah, I just heard if you, like, if you, you know, get too close to them, they'll charge you and try to trample you. They will. You they're, they're very, they're mean. They're, they are mean. We see moose from, you know, the truck. We don't get out and, you know, we're not like those people, the tourists in Yellowstone where they get out and try to put. <laughs> Did you hear that story last yeah, was what? where the people from out of town, I don't know where they were from, drove into Yellowstone and um, they felt so bad for the baby buffalo because he was by himself, which I think the mom was just off in the distance. They literally picked the baby buffalo and put it in the back of their car. And put blankets on it. Oh, oh, yes, I did. But the sad what thing about doing that, they yeah. had to put the buffalo down because uh, the bait, it wouldn't have gotten accepted back into its herd because they had messed um, with it. Yeah, they reject them, just like birds. Yeah. I know, when I oh, see oh, a nest yeah. full of birds, all I want to do is scoop them up and give them a hug, but I know you can't do that. <laughs> I know we had a bunch of bird nests out at our cabin and babies and we have a bunch too. And I love 
And even if you get too close to the bird nest and even touch the outside, the mom will come back. So you got to be super careful. Yeah, ours are kind of high up. We have like, I think they're blue swallows. They're beautiful little, beautiful blue oh. birds. And uh, one fell out. And I didn't oh. know about it. And there was nothing I could do. You know, I didn't know. I was hoping them. It, I don't know if it survived or not. But. What the heck So that's awesome, Amy. You need to take pictures. Yeah, for sure. I could see Amy out there with her fly. Swoo moose. Swoosh. <laughs> <laughs> I know when we were in Alaska, they told us to stay. If there were any moose, you were to not yeah. get close to them because they will charge you. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And they have those big, long legs. Yeah, I heard they trample you like horses. Oh, yeah. And stuff. Yeah, they'll step on you. Yeah, they'll be and like. They're a very majestic animal that are a lot bigger than they they appear. I'm far away. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and we all think, you know, just like um, walruses, you don't like they don't seem that big when you see them on TV, but when you see them in real life, holy cow, they are yeah. freaking <laughs> huge. You know, um. You know Julia lives in Alaska? That's where she lives? Yeah, she does. Really? I didn't know that. She's probably got yeah. the bears. Huh. I was going to ask you, Julia, is it true where you live that you sometimes during summer you only get like two hours of nighttime? Oh, yeah. That is true. Yes. And when, when does what when does it happen around in July or what or in June? I think that'd be just the coolest thing ever. Some nights um, only get ten. We only get six hours of darkness during summer usually because we're up in Washington. Yeah, uh, my husband goes up there. Once in a great while to go um, fishing. Did you see what Julia wrote? She said, they only trample you if you are acting adhesive towards them. I mean, she meant aggressive. <laughs> I thought that sounded funny. Is, is she? she, she uh -oh. You're being too clingy. <laughs> That's cute. I love auto -correct. It really cracks you up. Oh, my gosh. When Maggie speaks into it, to auto -correct? That's funny. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Let's see. Oh, in June and July, that's when the weather's like that. That's cool. Hmm. Hi, Sandra. Hello, Sandra. Hola, Sandra. Hi, Sandra. Sandra Pina. Sandra, yeah. 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 He's not too loud. He's I keep enjoying. him pretty fit. I when I take him to the vet, they tell me that he's one of the fittest Frenchies they've ever seen because I keep him pretty, you know. Oh, really? They will. They love to eat. They will beg and they they make themselves cry. Oh yeah, they do, and it's weird the way they yeah. cry is so funny. They make themselves cry. He he cries. I, and I, I, uh, sorry, go ahead. Yeah, it's crazy. I'm like, are you kidding me? You have tears coming out of your eyes and you're crying. You're making this cry noise. Yeah. So they he make they make you feed them. Oh, that would make me that would just break my heart. But yeah, I, the <laughs> only people I knew this one lady who had a Frenchie, and all I remember from it when I was a kid is that it farted like you could hear it fart and it stunk so bad. Oh yeah, <laughs> sorry. Junky food. Yeah, Sully so tells sometimes, but I feed him like he's kind of on a what do you call it? Like a raw diet. 
it's oh like, yeah that's I what think, chris and alicia have their dog on yeah i don't necessarily feed him raw chicken i boil it with rice and stuff like that and um yeah he gets better meals than we do hey uh rose amy wants to know uh where did you get the bling, bling trim that you're using right now this from her, this from her shop. This, this piece of fabric it's probably from LA. Which Amy one? Needs, Amy needs that trim that you're using right now. Like right now, she said. Right this minute? Oh, wait. We're on Katiri. Oh, wait. Sorry. Excuse me. We're on Katiri. Yes. Oh, so Katiri. Yeah, because I was like, trim? I don't have a trim. I'm looking for a trim right now. <laughs> I'm right over here. Yeah, you should see some wing trims. No, I, got, I think I got this in LA. At the fashion oh. district. Amy, let's go to LA. Oh my God. To their girl. Yep, I've had it. I've I had it for a while. I, I now I know what I was using it for. Yeah. We'll hit up Rose, Amy. We'll go to LA and hit up Rose. Yeah. I've been yeah. the can also for the night. Like Rosie, can we she loves it. She's like, oh my gosh, I love it. It is beautiful. It, I love your row of roses and how you're doing the back. Oh my gosh, here it's stunning, stunning. Super I may end up really liking this. <laughs> <laughs> Were you? You had? Did you have doubts, Miss Kateri? <laughs> well, yeah, sort of. Well, I did when I, I did. Figure I did out. Too started mine but once you start layering you get it it gets going oh you've got me sold amy we're going we're gonna meet there i've been there so is that, that material that you have in the middle then it's it's um it's a um we'll meet at lax it comes like that it's just a long rosette We'll have Dennis pick us up and take us through like, whatever it is. I've yeah. had it for a long time. Yeah, I that. Where do you find that? I cannot find that anywhere that I cannot find even those shabby rosettes. Like I know you guys always say you get them from uh what's it called? Uh that store Hobby Lobby, right? Yeah, they have them yeah. Hobby Lobby. Yeah, I need I because I look online, even like you know, China online. And they don't have, I can't find. Did you want I big ones or small ones? I think some of them come by the yard. Yeah. Yeah. They have those pools also. Uh, Which ones did you want, uh, Sierra? I want the big ones and the small ones. Okay, because the big ones, the big ones, because I can get them in L.A. Yeah, yeah. But the sm the small ones they do have them in the schools at Hobby Lobby. Yeah, they do. Oh, really? Okay. Mm -hmm. He would love it, LA beads. Yeah. Oh, I love it. I love the fashion district. Go home, Marcy. Well, I I I, I travel, Amy. So let's do it. Like sometime that would be so fun. Yes. I wish I, could I hope you wouldn't out. forget about me. No, I said that. I said we hit up Rose. I just said that we hit up Rose and they could take us. Oh to yes, of course. My husband, my hus my hubby will drive us. <gasps> Did you hear that, Amy? We have a second driver. <laughs> he, loves, he, he loves going to any excuse to go to LA. Really? Yes. I only like going for yeah, Rose is very lucky. Her hubby is amazing. He loves to do anything she wants to do. Yeah. So, yeah, my husband. Good, he's a good <laughs> He's a good soldier. Yes, he is. He's a keeper. Yeah, he's a keeper. <laughs> Amy's like, well, I'm about to be snowed in for eight months. How about next year? Okay. <laughs> 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 oh no, she, her car is going to turn into a monster truck again. She's got to get the oh, big no. tires back on her little car, cute little car. <laughs> oh, gosh, Amy. I miss you, Amy. My goodness. Crazy girl. <clears throat> 
Okay, let's see. Amy reminds me of this friend that I have. Mm -hmm. I don't see her often, but but she looks like her. So cute. Yeah. They always say you have a certain person that looks like you in this world. Yep. Yeah. Hopefully they're not your evil twin. Right? Yeah. She says she lives in the middle of nowhere in Maine. <laughs> she really does, too. I, I, I want to go to Maine so I can eat Maine lobster. Oh, my gosh. I know. I told Amy I'm coming to visit one day because I've never been on that side of the States. Yes. And visit Maggie. Maggie only lives a few hours from her. Yeah. It's really yeah, pretty over here. Awesome. They live so close together. That, I think it's just so super wonderful when you can meet up with your crafty friends yeah. in your life. Exactly. And I, like I said, I met, I got to meet Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. And I never dreamed of meeting anybody yeah. from, you know, that we talked to. And it, yeah. it's, well, it's a lot of fun. My daughter was like, you're going to meet an online person as you need. I'm like, Jenna. <laughs> yeah, it's like you're, right. yeah, it's like you're an online, um, yeah, like they, a meeting site or something. We're going to meet in a public place without yeah. any knives. <laughs> that's what we, that's what I did with, when I met my friend, Julie. Yeah. Yeah, we did that. We met it. We met at a Starbucks. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's time. I, huh? Yeah, when I met when I met up with my friend, um, I the first time I was like, oh, you know, you ne you never freaking know, unfortunately, which is yeah. sad. We're taking we, chances. <laughs> yeah, we met a uh, her. We, I met Marsha at uh, a really a hotel that's really cool up in Butte, and uh, oh my gosh, she was. It was it was so fun. Like we could have talked for days. Yeah. That's, mm. Yeah. And I think that with all you guys, you know, it's just That's a great idea, uh, Maddie. Yes, Amy. Crafty retreat. Is that who said that? Yes, the Maddie. crafty retreat is awesome, but I think some of us would be like, uh, like me, I don't fly. <laughs> You'd have to all come to me. <laughs> We'd have to Skype you in. <laughs> the retreat. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't Sarah, like. Sarah, we'll just give you a few tequilas. Yeah, give her some Call tequilas. Please. Calm you down. <laughs> then, she'll see, then she'll see a lady on the plane churning butter. <laughs> oh my gosh. Have you ever seen that show, Bridesmaids? Oh no. Oh, well, one of them has a really anxiety of flying, and her friend oh. gives her of a cocktail and a pill and she starts oh, seeing things and she thinks oh that she's gosh. the lady on the wing that is churning butter a primitive lady <laughs> my oh, God. We, we did that with my mother-in-law she was afraid of flying and so we got her some uh like a tranquilized tranquilizer oh God. yeah some benedict just, uh like it's a pill you know to just relax oh, dream, is it dram dramamine uh, I don't know. I think the doctor gave it to her. Okay. It's like so, clonazepam or aprazolam or whatever. I know what you're something about. like that. And she uh, did relax. She said, yeah. She goes, I slept. Look at these little itty bitty little tiny things that are in this kit. And I'm I'm using them to put in the center of uh, the little flowers that, that um that yeah, used. that's how that's, that's how she wanted cool, it. Paula. Oh really? Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I, I read her in your mind. So look how pretty the sparkle looks on that dress. Did I put the, I put those on the kid, right? Yep, yep. Yeah. And I put them. Awesome. Thank you. So here's mine so far. So I put on um this, and then I'm gonna add some beadwork and some cane work. I think hanging down. I'm gonna add this. I put a green bead on there to tie in the green, and then the back here will have this big poofy thing oh. that I uh, sewed up some ribbon here. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just um, adding little the little tiny. What do you call details, these little details? Yeah. What are these called though? What's that, hun? I'll show you. Hold on. Let me pick it up here. This. 
Oh, right the, oh, the little bling? Is a little bling? Little, they're little rhinestones. Okay. Flatback. Flat yes, flatbacks. Oh, they're flatbacks, yeah. Iridescent flatbacks. Little itty bitty yeah. ones. Right. So yeah. I'm just scattering them about on the dress to give it some sparkle between in the. Look, uh, uh, Angie, I now have them like this, loose. <gasps> what? Yeah, so. You better yeah. sleep with those. I because I love gonna be here. the kids, so. Wow. Yeah. Wow, those are gorgeous. Let me look at those again. Hold on. I love the sparkle. They are so oh, amazing. Oh, my God. Are they flat back? Tiny, itty bitty? Yeah, they're the same as the ones you have on the, on the, uh. Oh, African. my gosh. Yeah, those are cool. But they're yeah. not, they don't have stickiness to them, right? No, they're just, they don't have stickiness, no. Oh, I love those. Gosh, yeah. I need that whole container right there. I just want to swim it up. I, I don't know that you need the whole container. Those are beautiful. Well, I buy it by um, bulk well, because of, you know, the kits. For the kits. Right. I have your address, Rose, so. So the next kit, yes. The next kit, um. We'll have those loose. Oh, baby. Mm -hmm. Thank you, That's Julie. Amazing. I appreciate that. Oh, hi, hi, Gail. <laughs> there you are. She's been having problems with sound. I, found, I get all that in, in uh, LA, Judy. <laughs> She's an LA girl. The oh, ones that, awesome. that uh, you guys got on the kids oh, this last time? Yeah. Um, those, I got those at a, it's like a, they call it a bargain store, like, like the 99 ones, mm -hmm. but they, they don't, they don't have those anymore. So that's why I, you know, I had to look for them because I love them so much myself mm -hmm. that I found yeah. them in LA. Wow. Well, these are like, awesome. Why? Stuff. Amy has to go do yoga, she said. No, Amy, we need to do yoga again. Yoga's good. Yeah, we did a 30 day uh, challenge a couple months ago. Oh. <laughs> and Amy's been going. Yeah. Yeah, about Bye, the 30 day. Amy. Have a great day. Have an, a great weekend. Have a yoga terrific day. <laughs> That's cute. Mm. Yoga terrific. Now comes the sewing. What was it the other day? It was my dog got a spool of my lace, and I heard him oh, just no. a great time. It was when I was with you, Katerin, we were on the other night. I oh. could hear great time with something. I'm like, what's happening? I go in there, the whole thing shredded. Oh, my <gasps> oh. And he just looks at me like, what, what, what's happening? I didn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> How old is he? Why do you look at me? He's only, he's four, but he thinks he's, oh. he's a newborn. He thinks he's, he's a, like a puppy. puppy. Like the owner. His mom pulls, I'm new. I'm new at this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I am new. Exactly. <laughs> Learned it from you, Angie. <laughs> I, I am new. I am new to this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What? What? Yeah. Whatever you say. You guys are the yeah. experts at this stuff. Look yeah. At yes, Angie. What's new? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at Rose. I'm new too. <laughs> no. I'm very new. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> sure, Rose. Sure. I love what you're doing, though. Oh my! I don't know gosh. where the camera is at, but this is what I've done. <laughs> Bring it in a little bit more up towards. There you go. Wow. Oh my I gosh! Yeah, I can't see on the screen. It's like mine is lagging. So I don't know what I'm. What? She's I'm just doing. shaking it around. <laughs> okay, so bring it up towards. There you go. A little bit more in up. Uh oh. 
Is she breaking up for everybody or just me? I, I, yeah, there she goes. Oh, oh, Rose. oh no, we lost Rose. Oh, well, she's still here, but she's, uh, she's trying. Rose, come back. Come back yeah. to it. Come home. Oh, Julia Rose. says she's getting buffering now, too, but I'm still good. Let's yeah, I am, too. I mean, it's still moving on my end on Facebook or on YouTube. Yeah. I hope not. Maybe come in and out again, Rose. Yeah, I'll go out and come back in. Dead time, dead, what do they call that? Dead silence? No, uh, what do they call dead time? Dead time? Yeah, for the, the who Shit. are they? They're the people that do, I don't know. They're the ones that do the. They're blaming it on Angela or on Angie. Oh. They're blaming me. I broke. I broke Rose. Oh no! Yeah, you were telling her how to move it, and I guess it just screwed it up. <laughs> well, she said she couldn't see, so that could have had something to do with it. Yeah. Is um, Gail coming in? I don't know. I've sent her a link twice, so I have no clue. I'm just trying to work on my dress, trying to get it done. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Judy says dead air. They said do, um. I love that. What? Oh, go ahead. Oh, I was just saying they're saying it's jumping. The screen's jumping. Oh. Well, I didn't see that happening. Hold on. Well, that's weird because that's on. It is jumping. Why? Because it didn't on anybody. That's why. Because um, um, Rose went right. off, and when Rose or somebody goes out, and comes back in, then the screen jumps. So I have it on me. Yeah. Sorry about so that, I, lady. <laughs> we're just seeing if you're paying attention. <laughs> yeah, we're making sure you're all still awake. <laughs> No pay oh. attention there. Yeah. It's hard to think about sewing, putting a girl woman together, and then all of a sudden you have to attend it's still jumping. It's still jumping, that's what I was just gonna say. It's Why? Jump jumping. I don't understand that because it's Sometimes I double click on it because it's not fast enough. So just make sure you only, even though it seems like it's not doing it, just only click it once. I think we're good now. I hope. It's not jumping. It's not jumping that I can see. I think we're good. No, it's still doing it. Is it? Oh, no. Wait a minute. You've got to wait. Um, I forgot it's on a delay. YouTube to catch up, yeah. That's oh so my gosh. The way I've got that you sit down that girl's boobs. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sorry, but I'm trying to dress the that's woman. Just how it is. Yeah, I mean that's just how it is with when you got a big bus line, right? Yeah, <laughs> I guess. I'm like, the girl's got some hips. Yeah. He had some, he had tips for weeks. Mm -hmm. Some junk in the trunk. Yep. That'd be right. Junk in the boobs. What are you talking about? <laughs> junk everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> you got a lot of it's like, extra it's like, <laughs> it's like business in the front and party in the back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah, I guess. Yeah. And that because 
It's party all over the place. <laughs> yeah, it's like a party from the front and the back. It's like a club. Party up, party up, down, and all around. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Funny. She, Paula says she wants the she wants the waist. Oh, I don't want it. <laughs> waist is nice and it's tiny. <laughs> yeah. It's I can called um, a waist train. They have waist trainers out there, Paula. They're like a corset and you tighten them every day. Oh um, my god, yeah. I remember oh, I couldn't have lived in that time era. Yeah. Yeah, me neither. Or even like the the dynast the the where the Chinese broke their feet to make Oh yes. Yeah, that was to fit in those little tiny baby shoes. Oh yes. my god! The smaller the foot, the more desirable you were. Yeah, yeah. that like complete crazy. If I had to be by myself my whole life just to keep my foot. Then that's I guess that's the way I do it. And then your foot's just gonna like shrivel up and fall off one of these days, probably. Gosh. Yeah. yeah, they break them when they're little girls too. Yeah, it's mm. disgusting. Are those for geishas or whatever? Yeah. Oh, yeah. A little tiny. Yeah. Have you ever seen the way they do them? They like break their their center of their foot and squish it together and they fold yeah, their they squish it together they and then it grows like actually together yeah. the two pieces of the when you fold it into the Hello, shoe. Oh, I'm back. Oh, there Yay. you are. Yeah. We had a our whole internet up. Yeah, I yeah, I got disconnected, so came back. Yeah. Rose is back. We're still here. Okay. Rosie's back. Welcome back. The Badonka Dog. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's clean this. They're saying welcome yeah, back, Rose. I love how your yeah, other um, dress form came out. I love how you, when you have your camera up, you can see it right behind you on the shelf, and it's just stunning. Are uh, you going to put uh, the other one up there too? I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do. I really don't want to be reminded of of being heavy. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I am trying to lose weight, so <laughs> we'll see. It'll go somewhere. Yeah, once you get, um, gosh, my or maybe is... once I lose weight, I should have this out to remind me not to get back to it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. Oh no. Oh, no. Um, once you, cause I, I don't know. I don't think my lady, once I was done with her, she didn't <laughs> look very heavy if, cause I really flared out the dress, but I think once you, if you really get it flared out, they don't even look like they're heavy yeah. or like she's a heavy bird. Gee, chica. Chica. <laughs> but yeah, she definitely looks way different compared to the actual, like, own dress form, she looks way bigger, yeah. taller, and Gail says an itty bitty waist with a big round thing in your face. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mix a lot here. <laughs> Oh. Okay, I guess we're all concentrating. Concentrating. Don't yeah. everybody talk at the same time. That's right. Put interrupting, Rose. <laughs> yeah, gosh. <laughs> Stop it, Rose. Sorry, <laughs> Rosie. Rose is the troublemaker. No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's trouble. Here, just trouble. Oh, no. 
Double trouble. Double trouble. Double trouble. Okay, Maddie. Hurry up. You might miss something. <laughs> Where's she going? Been good. Oh, I'm not asking. <laughs> you know have fun in the restroom. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> what does that mean, Gail? We are sing? <laughs> singing. Singing. Sing. The singing was from Mix a lot in the chat. La, 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 la. So Gail, um, la, la, la. she has a lot of videos up, right? She's been crafting for quite a while. Who? Gail Lopez. Yeah, I, oh, I yeah. Know. yeah, yeah. So, ladies, hey, anyone Teresa. that sorry, I'm sorry. You're fine. You know what I was saying? Teresa came no, in. No, go ahead. I need to. Hi, Teresa. Hello, Teresa. I need to see if I'm sub to her. I think I am. Yeah, I'm making sure I'm sub to all you ladies. I'm making sure I'm sub to Gail. Um, but Gail, she does do video. Okay. Let me. Um, oh, my Oh, and I subbed. Teresa, I subbed. Hey. I'm already subbed. Yep. Yep, I'm subbed to Teresa. Yeah. We are ladies. T tonight is the three month giveaway, ladies. It is already? For those of you that are on the list. Wow. <laughs> So those of you that are on the kit list, you could get your next kit free. Woohoo! Tonight on Laurel's channel. Yeah. Well, we'll You're welcome. Just... Um, we're working on Rosie's kit right now, her dress form. So be there, be square. <laughs> yep. Who's all going live with her tonight? Do you guys know? Um, I'm going to try because I told her I would. My uh, husband took yesterday and the day off, which um, oh. he says that, and then he was working this morning. <laughs> on his computer. Oh. Like, really? <laughs> He's like, I just have a few things. So, uh, depending on what we're doing tonight, but I'm going to try. Yeah. Okay. I might work on some felting because I haven't done that in a while. Oh yeah. I think Terry and I were talking about that yesterday. Was it yesterday? I don't even know. Yesterday? <laughs> the other day? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So, well, yeah, the other day. Yeah, so I think I wanna because I haven't done it for a long time. Yeah. <laughs> What's like, I'm not on the list. <laughs> it's just a, a crying emotion. <laughs> oh, you're tired, Gail? Julie, cyber girl. How are you? Okay, I gotta go Hi, find Julie. some. Yeah, kiss for you. Julie's here. Oh, hi, Julie. Hi, Julie. I don't see her. Or sorry, you, Jules. Or I don't know. It's, I what call her Julie. Are. I'm sorry. Is it Julie or Jules? Or? It's Julie. Her name's Julie. But they call okay. her. Oh, there you are. Julie, Jules before. I think that's Megan Laurel, though. I'm not sure. Hi, Julie. I don't know if you heard me. And Judy, Judy Parker's in here. Judy's in the house. A while already. Yeah, Judy's an awesome. She just hangs in there for sure. Oh wow, Gail, that's late. Me too. I went to bed late last night. I couldn't. So sleep. did I. Two o'clock in the morning. Yeah, I couldn't sleep. It was. I had such a headache because I didn't go to bed until four o'clock the night before. So oh. I hit the bed last night. <laughs> Why is that? <laughs> Well, we were just up talking. <laughs> yeah, you're trying to do a vampire now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Hey, we had a good time. We That's did. all that mattered. 
Amen. That's all that matters. It's and worth it. Night. And then I was up at seven o'clock, seven thirty. That so I didn't get any sleep. It's worth the headache, huh? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> so I'm glad you gave enough. You know what about Rosie's kits is that she, you know, gives enough or more. Um, because I'm still have enough to put these little flat backs on the center of the flowers. I'm still going. Yeah. Oh, Sandra's leaving. Who's okay, leaving? Sandra, you have a great Hi, week. Sandra. Hi, Sandra. Hi. Thanks for coming Hi. in. Okay, I guess this is turning out to be some kind of a wedding dress. <laughs> yeah. I feel like mine is like a garden, like a wedding garden theme. <laughs> well, you know what? Yours looks so most mystical. Like, that's what I was trying to go for mine was to kind of be like, um, yeah, like this wedding kind of thing. Yeah. I like that look. Thank you. Like mythical or whatever you want. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of like, like the girl in like legend or labyrinth kind of yeah. like that uh like Looks masquerade like dress. yeah <laughs> like almost like masquerade kind of in an elegant way i guess gardeny kind of thing which would be cool to make a mask with this too oh yeah that would be cool make it itty bitty teeny weeny what are you Bye. working on sierra um, what what are you working on oh i'm i'm still i'm crocheting around the edge of the oh. uh, that's right i forgot i will turn on my computer show you guys in a second something crocheting is not very exciting i love and plus i, I didn't get watch i actually watch people crochet on YouTube because I don't know why I think it's fun, but I can't do it. Yep. Yeah. Same here. I'm about to put out some more tutorials because I know that kind of didn't work out with what I had planned, but um but yeah I'm definitely gonna be putting out more tutorials. Crochet yeah. tutorial. I wish I I, do. I gotta do a vine and some roses and stuff but but i'm loving how this teapot applique is looking i can't wait to show you ladies it's oh, a lot of work involved because i'm having i first did it with the bigger yarn so it's um so it's a bigger applique that i can put on like the front of a altered book which that's what i think i'm gonna do mm -hmm. and then Oh, that's but then I'm going to um, make a cup as well. But I'm then I'm taking the the smaller crochet thread, to add more detail on it to go around the edges. So wow. it has a detailed edge. So yeah, I'm really excited to show you these. And then I'm also putting like a rose on it and stuff too. Sounds so. gorgeous. Yeah. It's really cool. I used to crochet when I did photography. I just made like baby blankets mm -hmm. and baby hats, you know, like the Santa Claus, the long comb mm -hmm. kind of things. Oh, yeah. But I could never get, you know, detailed like what you do. I just, I don't know. Well, it all depends on the size thread you have and the size yeah. model. Yeah. And everything. Yeah, I've tried though. It's just I don't know. I That's try it. to. It just doesn't. Yeah, I was actually thinking about putting together some kits, like some crochet kits, to like cool. make certain things mm -hmm. and send the designs. Like you have the hook, the yarn, everything you need plus the design. Mm -hmm. Because I know like a lot of people have been saying, I can't find those small hooks or I can't find that thread. And, you know, they don't know exactly what to look for when they're going out and, you know, for their supplies yeah. all along. So I was thinking about that, but I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, that'd be cool. 
That's cool, Gay. I'd like to see your mask that you made. Um, yeah. Gail or uh, Judy says that she yeah, you can't show wants. the mask if you don't come in here. Yeah, the dress form. Wow, I'm so glad Rose sent extra napkins. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to see your dress, Judy, too. Ouch. What happened? You burn yourself or you poked yourself? No, I burn it, but it's not bad. Terry, hot. I, <laughs> I don't like that thing. Huh. Dangerous job, let me tell Sounds you. Sounds really cool, Judy. I can't wait to see yours. I ended up painting mine. I can't go through the wheel. Okay, we're going to switch over to Rose. Let's go to Rosie. Well, what I'm doing now, putting on some trim around the waist mm -hmm. because the bodice will show, you know, what you don't want to see on here. So I have to make this a little pretty, like just cover it up. <laughs> and that's what I'm doing. Uh, I don't know how this is going to, I mean, I didn't plan it at all. So I just grabbed things. Uh, bring it up further, Rose. All we can, I, all we can see is her neck. How about the right there? Let me see. No, we just see your boobs. <laughs> we see the boobs there? Yeah. <laughs> I can see it. It looks good. Because, like, like on my screen, I can't. It's. I can't see what I'm doing. Flip it the other way. Like they'll see the skirt. Like turn it upside down. To, to, put the neck towards you. Let me just turn that thing off. Started with the shirt. Normally, it's not that you started with the. How's that? The top. There you go. What yeah. were you doing, Kira? Yeah. Do you good. normally start when you do a dress form? Do you normally start with the skirt, or no. do you normally no. start with the, the bodice? Top? Yeah. Huh. Yeah, I I start so with the top. But this now. time I'm doing it like this because I want the the bodice or the on the waist. I want it to be outside of the skirt. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know what you're doing. Yeah. It's going to be on the outside. Right. Mm -hmm. So I can still start it on top but and leave it undone. But, uh, you know, it doesn't I see really what matter. you're doing, yeah. I don't know what's going on. I don't, I don't, I don't get it. What do you mean? What do you mean you're outside of the skirt? No, the no, body you know, is gonna go on the outside of the skirt. Yeah, it'll, it'll lay oh, on the outside. Like a corset kind of thing that goes yeah. over your skirt. Oh, yeah, I see. Like okay. that. And then I'll put a a, a nice uh, like a bling around it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because I like I like the 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 lace that I'm gonna put over it. I don't want to cover yeah. that part, so I want it to go over. See? Yeah, I hear you. It's hard to cover some of those really pretty places. Looking good, Rose. Looking good. I don't know. I'm not really liking it too much right now. This. I'm just going with it. Just go with the flow. That's all you can do. Maybe I should just leave it like this. Topless. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> you should make like everybody. Just do, just just do this. Just put the flowers on it. Like, like yeah. this. That's it. <laughs> yeah. I, plan on, I plan on doing this, but... You can see that, yeah, kind of like this. Oh, yeah, that's gonna look good. 
Very nice. Very now, I, I got to get my flowers out. I don't have them out yet. I'm oh, still working on that dress. Stash of flowers. Really cool to cover her whole breast and top area with uh, little small flowers. That would be pretty. Yep. Wow. You got to check. You got to check this out. What? I um, did this trim all the way around the base of the of the oh. satin part. Oh yeah. And this is all I had left was an inch. Wow. <laughs> I had an wow. inch left. Wow. Like completely perfect. I was totally meant to be there. I put it down the um down the raw edge. Uh huh. Of That's the back, cool. and then I put it around there so that way it kind of you know continues, and then this will lay like that. I love it, it's so pretty, very, mm -hmm. very beautiful. So I better make sure I oh, okay, thank you, Gail. I'll, I'll check those out, can't wait to see it. Hey Fonda, I didn't see you, sweetie. How are you, oh, hun? Hello, Fonda. I didn't see her either. I hear a kitty. Me too. That's my freaking dog whining. Can you believe he sounds like oh. that? <laughs> oh, I thought it was a kitty. Like a freaking like child dying or something. I'll be right back. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a chat too. I'm like, it's not like a computer. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna melt this. Lana wants to know how everybody's doing. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. Yes, thank you for asking. I'm doing good too. Yeah. How are you doing, Fonda? Yeah. Why my computer's no, running? Don't do it. Don't do what? Oh, my dog hears the dog chains, and he's gonna. He's getting. Ready to bark. <laughs> it's like, don't really? you? Yes, he hears other dogs and it gets him. My my husband bought a, a um what do you call it? A clicker? Yeah. Yeah. So when the dogs bark a lot, you just mm -hmm. point it at them. It doesn't hurt them or anything. Just that you know, you, we can't hear, you know, that that sound that it makes. Yeah. Yeah. It just keeps them quiets them down. Really? Or even a, like our dog, she she's so friendly. She loves to jump on you. Like when mine does too. When pe when company comes over, she starts jumping on them. And of course, we don't like that. Mm -hmm. And so you just click on on the that little clicker, mm -hmm. and she stops. Really? To train her not not to do that. So is it like a noise that they hear, or is it like a yeah? They hear a sound. Uh huh. We don't hear it, but they oh, so it's like a high pitched sound. sound? And so, yeah, she goes, you know, gets off of you and just goes away a little bit. Yeah. And then later on, if you don't even need to use it a lot of times anymore, you just kind of point, like, and point it at them. Point, yeah. And they think that you're using it. And so before you even do that, they'll, they'll stop. That's they a good one. Yeah. They think about it, yeah. It's good for people that are, like, you know, um, out, and I'm, like my sister. Mm -hmm. You know, my sister goes, visits people and a lot, and she walks and and she does that. The dogs that are kind of barking at her a lot or whatever, she'll do that and they, they run away. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's yeah, crazy. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. I think those are great for walkers. <laughs> for sure. Oh, yeah, definitely. definitely. I'm going to use it for when I go on my walks. <laughs> Good idea. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, Abrel. She said we're knocking out of the park with the dress forms. 
Oh, thank you. Oh, she's still watching. Yes, she's such a trooper. He is. She's so sweet. <clears throat> yeah, it's only going on two. I say, I wonder if she's home yet. Don't think she gets home till two thirty, and she's an hour behind me. Oh. Uh, or I yeah. would have her come in here. Let's see. I think I can cut this off. I don't need you. You said oh. Abril, not at, you said Abril, not Laurel, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's Abril, not Laurel. Laurel, I think her battery. Died. Oh, okay. I thought they were talking about Abril. Yeah. Sorry about that. Phone. And Teresa, our oh, has to leave. Hi, Teresa. Thank you so much oh, for coming. Bye, bye, oh. Teresa. Yeah. Thank you, Teresa. Have a great weekend. Love and hugs to you. Bye. Love and hugs. Okay, let's see what kind of flowers I can make from from um, flower kit. April says we're keeping her entertained at in at her uh, dialysis. Oh, well, good. Um, that, yeah, that's good. Yeah, that is good. I know. I can't imagine having to go through that. You are a trooper, huh? For sure. Yep. Does anybody else like? Um, I I just I have a hard time liking air conditioning. Oh my gosh! You got to have it here. Well, I mean, we have to have it here too, but it gets makes me so cold because it's like a fake cold. So I have yeah. the heater on down here. Oh, oh yeah. I like the air conditioner because I can just cozy up. Or yeah, I know. Wear warm clothes or sit down. And my husband says, "What? Why are you covering yourself up with a blanket?" Uh, sitting down yeah. watching TV. I said because I like to cozy up like this. I like to snuggle <laughs> and. Let my hair on, and you know, I like to get my blankie. <laughs> That's true. I, as I'm, I, when I'm sitting here crafting, it just I get cold, and so I have to have a little space heater down here. And, um, but my dog, he like, I always say he tortures himself. He sits in front of it till it turns off. Wow. Because it uh -oh. like gets so hot. <laughs> and it's oh like, what are you doing to yourself? Yeah. Well, literally, his literally his hair is inside the little holes of the heater. Oh my it's, god! It's it until, until he suffocates the heater a little bit, like not like suffocate. It'll just like turn off. It'll re re reach temperature. Yeah, in front of it, and then and then he'll go lay on the floor, spread out like a frog. <laughs> so, you know, after he baked himself for about five yeah. minutes, has he, just he's, right now. he's baking himself. I say that he's doing it for attention because I won't pay attention to it. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, he is, Frenchie's are funny. I used to have a cat that would lay on the um, register. Oh my gosh, Solly used to do that when he was a puppy because like I said, he loves heat. And the heat was just blowing in his hair and he just loved it. And yeah. we had... Um, you know, he was about one years old, and we had left him for a couple hours, and we came back. I felt so bad. He he has a leather collar, but we keep it loose enough in case, you know, he gets stuck. He can get his head out of it. Uh -huh. He had, you know, his registration and all that on his, on his collar. And he was laying on the vent, and we didn't know we came home. <laughs> oh, my gosh, I felt bad. He had got his collar, his tag stuck in the vent. And he had oh. pulled the floor vent off. Oh, and my, oh my God. gosh. So when he came to greet us, he was dragging this floor vent. <laughs> oh, like, God. I 
didn't know whether to cry because he was trying to be happy, but he had this huge floor fan on. I'm just like, oh my gosh. Uh, but yeah, it must have been traumatic for him because he doesn't yeah, like it. Yeah. <laughs> Especially <laughs> like you, uh, my dog, oh. he sometimes will be itching his ears and his his toenails will get caught in his oh. hair behind his ears. And he will just, he'll like be squealing and hobbling around and, you know, and I'm like, and sometimes it gets so bad, and I even like file his nails and everything. Yeah, but he always gets, and there's not even like that many. I don't, and we brush him all the time too. But he has like super tight curls. Mm -hmm. But anyways, yeah, and he'll be like hobbling around trying to, and yeah, oh, I feel so bad. So, when he I, know, I feel it, so it bad. Looks, it looks funny when he's hobbling around with one foot connected to his head but it's but it's yeah sad <laughs> yeah i was like kind of laughed but because he was trying to be happy yeah. to see us but he had this huge floor for <laughs> <laughs> and also um, they like when they have something stuck to them they are constantly having to look over the shoulder like what is that what is that what it's following me <laughs> yeah oh my gosh he will he, i think he's just tried to get out of it and he couldn't so he pulled it out and then he he went in his bed, so I didn't know right when I came home till he was coming out of his bed, and I'm like, what the heck is happening? <laughs> <laughs> Pulling I around. Oh, I poor little guy. Oh, poor guy. Jeez. But that's what we do. We keep his collar loose, you know, so he can get out. But it, it must have been just at the right thing where he couldn't, you know. Thank goodness yeah. nothing happened to him, though, because yeah. dogs, they can get hung, you know, for cats. Um, they make those quick release collars yes. because cats get caught on everything. I swear, my cat, her collar pops off every two, three times a day. Yeah, my cat takes hers off. She won't leave it on. She finds a way to pop it off. And so. But I'll be right about, back. Okay, my one daughter. thing good about my cat is that she um, she goes outside. Well, she's an indoor cat, but we she wants to be outside but she doesn't leave the yard she just sniffs around and lays on the grass and so she's a good cat anyways mm. let's see here oh. <clears throat> <laughs> I'll be right back to one second. Okie dokie. Second's over. Yeah. Oh, come on, Rose. Give me a little bit of a time. Just kidding. Okay. Two minutes. <laughs> Two minutes. Two minutes, Rose. Okay. I think I am going to try. I don't know what I'm trying to find stuff to put on the front of this dress, but I think I'm going to use this. Oh, no, I'm buffering. Are you? Mm -hmm. Well, that's not good. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I am too. Let's see. Yeah, well, I hate being cold. <laughs> you have no idea. I hate being cold more than anything in the world. Cause you, the only way I can get warm is by getting in the shower. I and I get. <clears throat> I'd rather be cold than hot. Yeah, I'd rather be hot because I can cool down real easy. But I hate cold. I hate winter. But you know, the really weird thing is if it snows a lot, I love to walk in the snow. Oh, wow. I love you, it. It's you so could live in Montana easy. or Alaska or. Yeah. Somewhere where it's. Yeah, when it snows, a lot, I think it's very quiet. It's really peaceful and I just love it. Yeah, that's true. But then well, after it snows, I want it all gone. Yeah. 
it's got its advantages yeah it does i guess it actually every season does if you think about it I, you I, enjoy I every fall everything. all our season yeah, fall used to be my favorite time of year but um because i love all of the changing of the leaves and everything mm -hmm. i think it's really beautiful and i love the pumpkins and I just there's so much I like about it, but then it brings something else after it. So yes, you know, which I doesn't make it. me happy. <laughs> yeah, you can't always you can't, can't have it all. all. Yeah, and we do have it all. We just don't realize it. That's right. You know, that's why a lot of those people, those snowbirds, take off and go somewhere else. Yep. Because they can have the best of both worlds. Mm -hmm. I don't have that my, kind my of money. My husband would love to I do that, but I'm a scary cat. Really? All the people, new people you would meet. and My sister's mother-in-law did that. They had a house in Arizona. She had two craft rooms, one there and one here in Indianapolis. Mm -hmm. You can't imagine the stuff I ended up with. <laughs> it was ridiculous. That's a good uh, thing, I think. Some of it is. Some of it was really, you know, some old stuff. It all went to Goodwill. Stuff I, you know, they've come out with them. Um, embossing die cutting machines now and um she had a big shop but i didn't want it i'll let somebody else Whoa, have it. judy okay gotta go back and read all this let's see what she said paula says april i do also sitting here with air conditioning and sweater i'm always calling she is she um. says <laughs> And then uh, I'm with you, Rose. I can always add clothes, but not walk around naked. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, Artie, I mean, Maddie, I love cold, hate being hot. Yeah, I don't like being hot either, but let's see. April. Yes, Paula, my daughter runs the air conditioning until later in the year. I pull out my space heater. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> hot and cold, hot and cold. <laughs> And yeah. Says, hey, hey, hey. Now you be nice to us, snowbirds. <laughs> I didn't say anything bad. Maddie says they all come here to Florida. Best of both worlds. Yes. No. Yeah. And uh, April says, I do love to see snow, but from inside a cozy place. <laughs> <laughs> With a cup of hot chocolate or hot yeah. chai tea. Oh yeah, shy latte. Mm-hmm. Oh baby. <laughs> I love them. I make my own. I figured out how um Starbucks makes them. So I make them at home and it's the same stuff that they actually use. Yeah. Yeah, I, 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 you know, I used to work. I used to work when I worked, I worked at a specialty coffee uh place. I don't know oh, if cool. your ladies are familiar with the coffee bean and tea leaf. It's, no. Oh. That's, uh, the compet competitor. That's a uh, um, uh, Starbucks competitor. <laughs> what is the name of it? The coffee bean and tea leaf. Oh yes, I have heard of that. Yes, I managed one of the stores. Oh wow. And um, yeah, we did a lot of. Uh, teas and a lot of yeah. coffees. So yeah, I learned I, I learned how to make all of those specialty drinks. That's cool. That would be. So awesome. then I taught my husband, and now that I don't drink coffee right now, yeah, he makes his own lattes. He he makes his own cappuccinos. <laughs> you know, he bought his, his machine and yeah. Um, you save money because Ooh. those places are expensive. 
Oh yeah, they sure as heck are. <laughs> I have a coffee um, machine downstairs that'll do lattes, but or I mean in kitchen, but I never use it. Oh, you should. I should pull that oh, thing out. Yes. Make my own frothy milk. Yep. I have to be careful how much of that I drink because, you know, it's yeah, not you, good. You become addicted. Yeah. Well, I'm just worried about weight. I don't need to pick up any. <laughs> Trying to lose it. Maddie says that they, they, they do um, snowboarding every year. They love it. Yeah, yeah here I'd in California, we have the best of both worlds. When it's winter, it snows, we go to the mountains. Hot, we go, you know, to the beach. Yeah. If it's not too hot, it's spring, we, kinda, we go to uh, Palm Springs or to the, yeah, the desert. Hi, ladies. Hi, Gail. Hey. Sounds like you. Who is it? It's Gail. Oh. Yeah, I'm on FaceTime with Terry. You're supposed to be on here. <laughs> Not on FaceTime. <laughs> oh, okay. Well. I'm tired and I have to go pick up my paycheck. I have to take the girls to the bank. Oh, too much stuff. Too much. Yeah. Let it go. And I didn't get to bed till three in the morning. I couldn't sleep. Huh, well that's not good. you have FaceTime, can you FaceTime with people that live in different countries if you both have iPhones? Yeah. What you? Yeah, thank you. What'd you say? What'd you say, sir? sir? That, Sierra? Oh, I was wondering if you have FaceTime, can you FaceTime with people in different countries? I don't know. Um, I never thought of that. I was wondering. I don't, because that would be international. I would probably think not. That might be something to ask Maggie. I don't know if she's got an iPhone. And I don't know if Trish has one. Maybe if you can't, maybe they can. I don't but you know, really, the best thing to do is to do Hangout or Skype or um, you could do Messenger because you can do video stuff in Messenger. Yeah. yeah. Videos in Messenger. So I don't think it's as good as you know some of the other, but yeah, you could do it. What do you do it's for work? Hi, Hello, Gail. <laughs> Hi, everyone. You could. A couple minutes. Yeah, I'm going to get my computer off the man. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. I'm going to come in for a little bit. Hi, Donna Bell. Oh, hi, Donna. He wants to know what everybody's making. You I need to guys. switch over to somebody else. I'm just cutting out stuff. Angie left, so I guess we're going to Rose. <laughs> Lucky me. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, just I give them somebody else to look at for a little bit. I'm just cutting. And I and and I'm gluing. <laughs> well, right. Neither one of them are the best. But you know, I'm going, I'm going to bottom. 
or nothing's going to stay together. I'm using my fabric glue this time right now. So I use both. I use the glue gun and the fabric glue, and depending on what I'm doing. Yeah. So I'm just. This is not easy to do the uh, with netting like this. I know. Uh, th this fabric, this lace fabric that I'm um, I'm using for the bodice. Mm-hmm. You know, it's got mm -hmm. so many, a lot of holes. So. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, I have to really put. It makes it really hard. That's why I, I, I hot glue mine in places. Exactly. Just so I know it's, this so is, but this is the reason why I'm using the, the uh, fabric glue so that I don't see the. Yeah. You know, I want a, a very thin layer because it's it's not it's not even the netting. It's it's the fabric that the holes are like huge. Like, let's see. I don't know. Can you see that? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah. So, yeah, that yeah. yeah. That's why I'm wow. using the fabric glue. She's a modest girl, isn't she? Yes. <laughs> modest bread. <laughs> and I'm leaving her natural, like I like. I I didn't paint it. Well, I, I want okay. her her tan to show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, Judy says you can do Facebook around the world. Yeah, you can do Facebook anywhere for free. Yeah, Facebook Messenger. I know you can Messenger. And yeah, so they're working on dress forms. Um, Donna, I. Rosa Cozy had a um, dress form kit that they are working on and finishing up. And they are looking yeah. amazing. Yeah, they are coming. You know, you get to a certain point when you start putting, you're doubting what you're doing. Yeah. Like, Laurel, right or Laurel. Right like Rose said at one point, she says, oh, I don't know if I like what I'm doing. <laughs> I still don't. I'm like, I yeah, don't you know. still have to, you just have to get past it. Yeah, get past the ugly. <laughs> oh. Yeah. That's what they say with mixed media all the time that you just got to yep. keep on. Get past the ugly. Yeah. That's right. Then buffering. I know you can. Uh, what kind uh, of a wedding dress is that? Somebody tell me. Rose, look at that. Avril, put it down me. there. That's uh, awesome, uh, Maddie. I'm glad to hear that. I was wondering. Veracruzana? <laughs> what is that? It's a, it's a uh, yeah, traditional uh, Mexican, Mexican wedding dress from um, Veracruz, Mexico. Uh -huh. Okay. You know, every region has their own uh, traditional like costumes. Uh huh. They're for mm -hmm. folkloric costumes and such, and they they oh. it's also that way with wedding dresses. Oh uh, darn! I didn't know that. Yep, you can wear your a traditional wedding dress from that region. Yeah, did you know that the traditional wedding dress for um, ladies in India is red? Oh yeah. Mm. Hey, I know some uh, somebody that got that was married um, in the Indian way. Yeah, because that's her nationality. Oh my yeah. God, her dress was oh wow, it was gorgeous. Thank you, Donna. Had gold in it. Yeah, like it's like a sari. It's um. Oh like yeah. Red. You can add whatever other colors you want to it, really. Yeah, it, they're pretty. That's for sure. And then she turned around and had a she had a traditional American wedding. Oh really? I love that. I yeah. love it when they do that. The uh, what yeah. Asians do that too. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. two two weddings, like two different. You guys see, um, or it says like rich Asians. That's oh, that, that movie. Show. I'm gonna go watch that one on Sunday. I want to see that. That looks so funny. Oh my gosh, it looks so. What's funny. the name of it? It's um, called Rich Asians rich or something. Rich Asians. 
Yeah, crazy rich Asians or something. No, it's rich, but, rich crazy uh, Asians. Yeah. Huh. It's a funny movie. Well, it has a little bit of drama. About like um a Asian guy who falls in love uh -huh. with this lady in America, and they're in love and everything's good and she thinks he's just a typical guy with the typical amount of money and everything but then he takes her to asia and he's like a royalty over there and he, oh. uh, his family and everything has tons and tons of money and you know he's supposed to be marrying the right girl but he proposed to her so her family is given her or his family is given her crud and everything and yeah it's a hallmark movie <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Very much. Something wow. like something like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's cute. Where hmm. is my pink? So I have a said, bunch of lace no. that I picked up at Goodwill at the outlet mall and the and the uh regular store. Yeah, there and, we go. I have to come what if, what if, on it. Oh, Donna, thank you so much. That's so kind yes, of you no. to say. She's so creative. She loves watching you and you inspire her. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm going to your channel to subscribe to you right now, Donna. Let's see. Hmm. And then Abel said their textiles are gorgeous. Yeah, the Indian saris. Rose, God good God knows what he is doing. God knows what he's doing when he named you Rose because you make such beautiful things. Oh, that's so oh, sweet. That's so sweet. <laughs> America with Eddie Murphy. Oh yeah. <laughs> Do you ever watch Married at First Sight? No, I no. Not. I do not watch that. I I have to say I don't. That's just ridiculous. Because <laughs> yeah. they never stay. They don't ever get married or they gripe. But I can't handle that. There's yeah, enough I drama. Don't. I don't. I don't. I don't want to listen to somebody yell and scream at each other. Yeah. Yeah. No thing. Not my thing. I can smell my meat, you guys. Mm, yummy. <laughs> can decide if I just want to leave it the way yeah. it is or if I want to turn it into barbecue. So I can't see anything. Uh, Kateri, it's buffering. So Really? Nothing. Again? Again? Only the chat for me. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't. It looks fine you. on my end. Mm. If your phone or if your computer is slow, um, well, the chat's my it's just buffering. The screen is buffering. We're I'm on Kateri, but I have, it's just frozen. if I have my Google Hangouts on, it does that to me too. If my I have my Google Hangouts on for some yeah. reason, it does that to me. I can't watch the chat too. It's really stupid, but mm. it is what it is, I guess. Yeah, not a lot you can yeah, do. Yeah, just about like, it. okay, bro. She's so so oh, sweet. Man. Donna says I haven't been doing anything on my channel lately. I've been very busy. And Julie yeah. says, there I have enough. She she doesn't like the yelling and all of that and people either. She says I have enough in my life. I don't want it. Want yeah, I don't need them. It's everywhere, you know. But oh, I don't have to watch it on my TV. Donna says that she loves the show for weddings. Hey, Tammy. Hi, Tammy. My, one of my one of my favorite shows. One is that I watch in the winter when it comes on because they're filming it right now. Is um uh the curse of oak island 
and it's it's on uh, oh, A and E. Oh my gosh, I love that show. <clears throat> What's the name? Yeah, Katari? isn't that it's where there the is it? of Oak Island? They they're looking for this treasure that's over a couple hundred years old. Uh huh. That the, that the um. This is a reality uh, show. Reality no, well, yeah, it is, um, but it's these two brothers that bought pretty much most of this land. They own most of the land. It's up in Nova Scotia, okay. And they're digging for this treasure, and they're finding all kinds of stuff on this island. And um, it's very interesting. I love history, and I think yes. that's why I like it so much. Yeah, but it's yeah, it is all history. And they, you know, they talk about the Knights Templar and um, the, you know, the people that are associated with them. And right. um, it's because they think they're the ones that brought the treasure. They think it's the covenant that is buried. And it is the weirdest way that they have built these traps wherever the wherever it is, they have built these traps that they're tunnels and if you hit one of these tunnels it fills up with water so you can't dig anymore oh so it's supposed to be hidden but these guys got really smart and they started drilling little holes and they would they were bringing up all kinds of little things in these holes and wood and that shouldn't be 132 feet down and or 187 feet down. So yeah, it's pretty interesting. And the island used to be two islands. It's now one. Oh. So they think they sunk a ship in the middle of where the two islands were, and then they've made this um, that area that is now swamp. Um, that's kind of what brought the two islands together. So I don't know. You have to watch it. I mean, it's just, it's really interesting. Yeah. Donna says people have died there trying to find the, this treasure. Six people have died looking for that. And they're supposed to be seven before they can find the, that's why they call it the curse of Oak Island. She it's supposed says, to be seven people that die before you find the treasure. Uh -huh. Donna says they linked it to the Masons. Yep. And Judy says that they love, they're addicted to that show. <laughs> yeah, I know. You can't help but be addicted to it. I've watched repeats of that show so many times. Pitiful. Okay, Donna. Okay, I like this one better. Let's just see. Emmy says that she loves that kind of stuff, which I do too. Yeah. Huh. Let's see, can I stretch this to know? Okay, I'm moving, moving on. <laughs> moving on up. <laughs> yeah, Jefferson's. Yes, I love that show. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Where did Angie go? She Sorry. said, I'll be right back. She's not, uh -uh. Just doesn't, she's not there anymore. Well, I found out how to do that. Um, I made one of those, um, those heart, you know, that heart dangle thing that you showed me. I figured out how to yeah. do it. Made did one you for, really? Forgot to send it in your package. I just found it on my desk. Oh. Oh well, you Sierra, know. Sierra, Sierra. I got more stuff. I'll probably be ordering, so don't worry. Oh my gosh, I, I swear, I just man. You know that mind. last package you sent hasn't moved. Really? I mean, the, um, no, I keep the, looking. It's it's not gone anywhere. <laughs> it's. <laughs> do you? It get never the, does. Do you get the pegs yet? Huh? 
The snippet tag kit. Have you gotten that one? Uh, I got the tag, but there's another one that you sent. I don't yeah, remember what it was. The stick pin kit. Um. I'll take it yeah, right that's now. what I'm. Yeah, that's what I'm waiting on. So, just let me check. Yeah, I can check it right now. Yeah. Oh, my God, there's a bar. <laughs> there's a what? A bar? There's a bar. Yep, it has moved. Yay. <laughs> Piece of poop. <laughs> It'll be here Monday. Yeah, that's fine. But yeah, you print that. The bad thing is, is that when you print that label off, it yeah. sends me the notification. Oh, it's been sent. And I'm going, now I have figured out that it just because you um, print that off, it doesn't mean it's at the post office. So yeah, when uh, I print it off, it means that I printed it off, but then the postal guy comes once a week right. to pick the um, yeah. mail. You know, yeah. I got a big kick out of uh, Paula's uh, picture that she posted of all those boxes. <laughs> oh, I know. There. I can't oh, imagine God. him picking all of those up. <laughs> wow. And I'm surprised somebody didn't walk up there and steal some of them. Yeah, I know when you have so many packages, it's so much easier just to have the postman come and pick them up than just to take them all yeah. to the day. I have a delivery guy that does that for me. Yeah, that's me my too. husband. That's my husband. Oh, your husband. <laughs> you can set up, my, pick husband up makes the, my husband the makes the labels, mm -hmm. he prints out the labels and he puts them on. He takes pictures of, uh, of all the packages and then he takes them to the post office. He's wow. like, he, you know, awesome. he's he he awesome. Yeah, wow. I don't think I it's can. It's a lot of work. Yeah. Stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I, I wish I my husband did that. <laughs> well, your husband works. My husband doesn't. Oh, yeah. 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 He's got to do something. Well, yeah. that's super. Anyways, that he does that. That's really nice of him. Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, he's, he's supporting you. He is. He's supporting me. He's very supportive. Like your 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 uh, your little kids club. But sometimes, okay. Sometimes it gets a little uh, like, who's the boss here? <laughs> That's what I, That's what I did. Questioning me on things, and I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> oh <laughs> my! Wow. one questioning, not you. <laughs> That's beautiful. Rose, I love. Up. Look at that. These are on the boat bodice. My screen's oh, not you, working. Oh, okay. Can't you look at Google Hangouts and look at it? Yeah, go to Google and look. Go to the Google Hangouts and look. Um, let's see. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go on my, uh, my tablet. Your, well, well, you need to close your chat. And go put your chat on your tablet and just have your Google Hangouts open on your right. computer. That's, that's, yeah, that's that's what I do. Because if you have the the YouTube and the Google Hangouts open at once on your computer, that's why it makes it so you can't see. I'm gonna check out my aunt. She is still sleeping peacefully. With my dex card. I know. I still owe Judy a oh, dex there card. It is. Wow. I lost it. That's beautiful, Kateri. Yeah. It is, Kateri. Isn't she cool? It's yes. <laughs> yep. I covered what, what was there. She's beautiful. I love it. I love it. Look at that. It. Oh, I don't like the back. Like a quinceañera. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, I can cut this now. It's dry. You look like a very young bride. But yeah, I cannot. 
it that's beautiful. I okay. Love that trim, that six layered rosette trim. That's so sweet. You know what we need to do? Did you um did Sierra, did you post yours on Rose's Facebook page? Um on our Facebook. Yeah, maybe I'm that's what we should do since she doesn't do a video. Yeah. I take her on mine when I post it and then I and then she wanted us to put an in inspiration alley, but yeah, I will just tag Rose and repost it. One mail. Yo. Oh. One of those is for candy in there someplace. Oh, okay. that one there is. Oh, that's not fair. Mm -hmm. That's not fair. She's got candy. Who has candy? Sierra. Sierra. Oh, wow. I just got some happy mail. Oopsie. Oh, oh my, mom, my mom's name is Candy. <laughs> oh, well. Hey, Gary, yeah. Tammy wants to know if you can put something uh, dark behind because so much white, it doesn't let you really focus. It's hard to see something when there's a lot of white. That's true. Okay. I should be able to oh, see yeah. that. Oh, yeah. That's nice. That's a lot better. Yeah, I'll get pictures. And, and then here's the back. Wow, wow, wow. There Got a train. And they completely love it. It's beautiful, stunning, gorgeous. Terry, can you... Oh, yeah. Everybody's just saying how beautiful it is. Really stunning. And I did put rice in my girl. Really helps a lot. For yeah, that was a really good idea to do that. Put yeah. the rice on them. Yeah, give yeah. it some weight and stability. Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess I could put some. Oh, I could do this. Do I want to do this? We'll see. I mean, I have this. I could use it. Or not. <laughs> well, here. See? Here's one. I'm not sure if I want to do that. Or if I or, or I could do this. Oh, I might do that. That means I have to sit here and cut these out. <laughs> Who in the chat wants to help me cut? Fussy cutting. Yay. Fun, fun, fun. <laughs> It'll be worth it, though, when you get done. Oh, yeah. It always is. That's, uh, Tammy, that's what uh, Rose is doing with hers. My, um, these dress forms actually come all like this. They're already, they already have a. Yeah, they already have the hips, the poof and Yeah, all. the stand's already on them. That's really the nice. That's the nice part about those dress forms is you don't have to add a bunch of layers of tools to make the hips no. pop. You already got No, the, yeah. It already does it for you. Yeah. And I think it looks so much different when they're covered than when they're naked. They look completely different. They don't look like they're the form that they are. Yeah. That's true. You're right. All right. There's one applique. I don't even know where this came from.
so I can scatter these around. That would be pretty. Totally. I was thinking to attach her name, yeah. <laughs> Judy says, my, co my clothes cover a lot. <laughs> That's true. Clothes do. I'm so glad. I have to tell you. I'm I'm kind of glad that Adam and Eve um, um, ate that fruit because I don't care to walk around without clothes. Yeah, no thanks. <laughs> um, and Tammy, that's what, yeah, Rose is going to put a glass candle holder on hers. I think that's what Kateri just already answered that, but so yeah, you can make her dress longer. I have one that's actually got um, a um, candlestick on the bottom that I got from Sierra. Yeah, one of those pink cushion ones. I just love that dress form up there. Did you get your box from Polly yet with that with those beautiful dangle flowers? I got it. I got it yesterday, and I haven't even looked in the box. Well, I take that back. I have it open, and I saw the first couple of things. Um, there's some flowers and stuff in there that I won't use, but um, that's yeah, as far as I got. Flowers, they're so pretty. If those are the ones I'm thinking of, they're just, like, amazing to use in anything. Although, you know, you can gesso them and change color. Yes, you can. Because some of the colors are, I'm sitting here looking at it right now, like gold. I'm not using gold flowers. Yeah. And then there's like, there's this one. Oh, yeah. The darker. I mean... You could make a uh, boho kit. That's what I'm doing with a lot of my dark stuff is making boho. Things. Oh, are you? Yeah. Yeah, and there's a bag here. It, the same bag's got a bunch of ribbon and stuff in it. Yeah. I can see you now. Hallelujah. Really? Oh, my gosh. Look at this flower. See, I told you I didn't look. Can you see that? Oh, wow. Look at that. It looks just like that. Wow. That's iridescent. That's cool. Big time. I mean, this, this one is too, but not like this. This is, this is crazy. Wow. wow. Gosh, this bag smells good. Yeah. Yeah. There's um Yeah, she, I love how she puts in the dryers. Oops, you get up here. I, I got to have you. You go over here. Oh you ladies be kind to each other. You don't aren't no one's fat. <laughs> we're, we're all just, just huh? we're big boned. We're big Oh. Yeah, dream on. <laughs> <laughs> now, I I I do have my aunts. My great aunts were all really big bone people, yeah. um, and they they were not what I would call overweight. They were just big bone big people. Yeah. But I'm overweight. They didn't have stomach. I have a stomach. I need to lose it. Because me, if I'm like a size nine, I seriously, if I'm at, because um, I'm pretty big boned, and uh, if I'm at like a size nine and I weigh under 160 pounds, I look anorexic because I'm so tall and I'm just big right. boned. Yeah. How tall are you, Sierra? I'm like 5'8". 
I'm not oh, super. Wow, you are tall. I used to be five, um, five, five and a half. And when I went to the doctor the last time, I was down to five, four. Mm. So, yeah, that's due to my collapsing spine. Oh, oh yeah. That, that. When you lose, when you, when you get older, you lose the cushion between your joints and stuff, yep. especially spine and back, and it makes you shorter. Yep. And then if you also have any issues or problems like back or issues, problems like that, that makes it even worse. Yeah. I've told uh, Rose this earlier, but I got a phone call from my doctor's office today and I have to go back in for a, a, a diagnostic yeah. and an ultrasound because I just had my mammogram and I'm praying that they're just going to say, well, you just have whatever they call it. Cyst. Yeah. Fibroids. Yeah. They're yeah. going to say, stop having caffeine. Stop having the cheese. Stop I can't, yeah. Chocolate. They do that. They tell That'd me to quit having cheese. Yeah. Then I have to go off of the keto diet. Well, on. ladies, you want us to stay on while we're still working on this, or you want us to quit? Are you tired? Because it's I'm going so on. Sorry. I'm so sorry, you guys. I so apologize. I had to go help my husband move a chair. Yeah, what did you do? Go to, did you go to Tennessee and back or something? I did. I had to help my husband move the trailer out of the side of the house. I had to be the foreman. I'm so sorry. Oh, you're That's okay. That's okay. I'm like, Jeff, I have to go. I'm so sorry. I... Yeah. I'm feeling horrible. I'm so, so sorry. It's only 20% off of everything. And then tomorrow's 40% off of everything. And then next week, next Friday and Saturday, that's it. And they're just going to try to. Probably go tomorrow. So I learned right now. Right. I learned that's looking beautiful. Sorry, sorry, ladies. Is that your husband okay. talking? So this is my son, my beautiful son. Oh, yeah. handsome son. Like, tell oh, me what's the son. Joanne's. Get the Joanne's. He brought me a package. Oh. Ooh, you know, from the. <laughs> from Amazon. Oh, yeah. That's, that looks beautiful, Kateri, by the way. Oh, yeah, okay. I did. Yeah, yeah, he was telling me that there's an estate sale one a house oh. on the block here. Oh goodness. Oh. Uh -oh. You go. He's we'll like, you it. should go. I'm like, I'll go after this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm I'm but I, you wanna you wanna say, click on me? What your haul is from the thrift store. I'm really excited I'm to sorry? see that. Um Kateri, she said she oh. was gonna do a thrift store haul, and those are my favorite kind of hauls. I love it when people do thrift store hauls. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to do it today after we get off of here. Yeah, I really want to see what you got. Carrie, you want to see my, my dress? I guess you could see it now. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me switch. Oh, shoot. And then, yeah, I got I got oh. a lot done, Angie, while you were gone. Oh, gosh, I'm so <gasps> sorry. Wow. See, that looks <gasps> really good. Okay. No, oh my I gosh, I not. love it. I know. My head was like, can you just help me for a minute and end up turning out to be like, <laughs> I don't even know, a half hour. Like, oh, half hour. Am I showing it right? Wow, oh, that's gorgeous. Yeah, it looks good. It's completely beautiful. I love it. Uh, yeah. I don't know what I'm showing. So. I love how different all of these look. Yeah, I love how I wish you could line them all up and take pictures because yep. I think that it would be so awesome if we could do that because they all turned out so much different. I think mine looks like a little fairy princess or something. And then it's Laura beautiful, looks Sierra. Like I mean, you put a lot, a lot of work into it, Sierra. Oh, thank you. Yes, I had so much fun. 
And then per Laurel's looks like a purple modern diva kind yes, of. Yes, it does. Yeah. Uh, her dress. And yeah. then she is looking kind of whimsical. And then Kateri's looks like a, like a, either like a wedding. Or, uh, <laughs> Hers is like a little bit very, of Yeah. Yeah, mine's like kind of fairy, not fairy, like kind of gardeny. Yeah. Um, kind of like that, I guess. I we could be wedding dress designers, you guys. Right? Yeah. Not one show. Yeah. But I would want to do it. I have to tell somebody, this is what I want, and you have to make it. <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> you have to make it the way I say. Yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> Yes, Rose is very talented. Oh, yeah, she is. Well, I'm just, I have to just do some chain work, I think, and put the bus, the whatever you call it, bustle, or the big poofy thing, emphasize yeah. that a little bit, and I'm going to put some beads on mine. And then yes. my Tim Holtz topper thingy. That's a really yeah. good idea. Yeah, a little spindle thing, or whatever you call those. It's like a chest piece. I've got to wait on my glue to dry. So, yeah, I so have to say mean, I'm at a stopping point. Yeah. yeah. I can't do anything else. Yeah, and then I'm going to put these little dangle beads right here. This, this thing is so tall, it's hard for me to show you guys. I know. I'm going to do this right here. It's really hard. It's actually hard to work on with it with the camera, kind of, because you want to stand it up. Yeah, Long exactly. Time. So I'm gonna um oh thank you so much, Maddie. I'm gonna put this, hang this down here, and then I'm gonna do some um some chain work right here and hook it onto this piece. Oh, and wow. I'm gonna put this nice. little um topper right here up here. And that'll be You know what yours like? Yours looks like almost like a elfin princess or something. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like like a um, like elfin or whatever you want to call it, kind of like a. And then that here's the, show. Yeah, and then here's the back. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna make another poofy thing, and this will be the back here. And then I and then I have like this little homemade thing that I like to add to my stuff, and I'll put that here. And I think yeah. that's it. Hopefully, because more. You is know more. what I think. You know what I think we should do. What. All of, and you may not want to, but I think it's kind of cool ideas. All of us that have made these dress forms, uh -huh. you know, put our put our have a uh, rose, put our names in a in a um, bowl and pull them out, and the first two have to swap. <laughs> and then two more people have to swap. <laughs> I don't know if you would want mine. <laughs> I, I, I'd be willing to do that. I would too if I if I was mine's confident in my mine mine's already gone. <gasps> What'd you do with it? You sold it. Well, I I almost sell all my projects because I don't have anywhere to put them because I don't have That's those. Uh, yeah. You know, I was actually thinking of selling this one too, but I don't know. I'm kind of loving it. Yeah. But, <laughs> I, I, you know what I mean? Yep. I've never yeah. one, but I'm kind of with you, Sierra. But uh, I don't know. I'll let I you guys. Okay, I yeah, want I don't everyone's have... opinion here. I want to know if I should put this uh, cluster on on here. Mm -hmm. I I do like it, but I don't know. I'm not sure. Of oh my gosh, if, if anyone else thinks so, I might take this one off. Mm -hmm. I like all of the frilly stuff you have on there. Can you turn it around? Turn it around? Yeah. Yeah, we'll Present definitely it. have to post all of ours for sure. I'll make sure I take pictures and Yeah, I think it um, looks really nice. Yeah. I, I like, like it. I'm all about that, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> you could even you could even spray those a, a light green color rose. Oh yeah. yeah. It would bring the well, you're probably not. Yeah, I don't have green on. I don't have any green. Yeah, I don't have the, the green. same fabric. 
No, I love that. I love Mine how is it, more like a, it's like a, a cream color. Yeah, yeah that's beautiful. I love like how that um that underneath comes down on the dress a little bit. I think that's beautiful. This here? Like the little no, the the flower cluster that you oh, have this up here. there. I like all of that, yeah. Okay. That is really cool. All right. Very I like to have a dress like that. Yeah. I could see somebody in Hollywood wearing that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. All right. All right. I see y'all. Yeah, I'm at a stopping point too. So I'm just gonna add the beat right. and the chain and the back and the stamp done. Yeah. Uh, I'm getting a backache now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm standing. Oh, gosh. Yeah, we need yeah. to let mm -hmm. Well, I'd rather do it that way because if I sit down, it'll be worse on me because oh. of the, how big this is. Yeah. Because I did have it on, on the uh, on the candlestick, but it mm -hmm. fell apart. I don't oh, know what I'm going to uh, use. I already tried something different. E6000. E6000 works really good with glass. Okay, I'll, I'll yeah. put that on too. E6, I, what I use. Yep, yeah, yeah. that works. I found the best with glass. Okay. Yeah. Hey, everybody. We're going to go ahead and shut down the, the uh, live feed. And um, like I said, I really appreciate everybody coming today. Yes, thank you. Yeah. Thank you for having thank me. Thank you so much, Maddie yeah. and Tammy. Thank you so much, Kateri. Judy, oh, you're welcome. I'm glad you guys were able to come on, and I'm really glad we are getting these done. Me too. So, thank, I don't know if Donna's still here, but thank you, Donna. Thank you very much, ladies. So, Hope to see you tonight with uh, Laurel's. Yep, yeah. yep, we'll be here. So thank you. Bye-bye, everybody. Very pretty on the, on the candlestick, Sammy. <laughs> the desk. <laughs>